Hello everyone, I'm glad that the mic didn't pick up what you just said, because holy shit. Hey everybody, <laughs> happy evening times. Oh, it's Chrissy, thank you for the resub for five months, god dang. Thank you, Chrissy. Thank you. Oh, and Cora, thank you for contributing to the Kill 6 Billion <laughs> Demons challenge, and Vera as well. God dang. It's a lot of demons. So, we've got a tiny, tiny, tiny... <laughs> Wow, almost half a year now, Tilda. Ah, uh, almost half a year now, Tilda. Terrell, thank you. Five thank months, you, Terrell, got, the Tilda. Got dang, that is, yeah, that is subbing since we made affiliate. I think at this point, so uh, y'all are uh, be subbed too. Y'all are the originals now playing on the CW. Wow. Uh, <laughs> Uh, let's switch. Oh god, it happened again. Why does this keep happening? What happened? Uh, we're doing incoming message from the big giant head again. Uh oh. God. I don't know what that means. Are it means... Go? Oh, that. Okay, that. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah. Oh. A hype train? Oh. <gasps> Could it be? Could it be? Could it be our first hype train? Yo, level two hype train! Holy shit! Oh, this has oh. never happened before. Yeah, <laughs> blah, it's, blah, blah, blah. never happened. I don't really know what that means, but I'm excited. Yeah, I like me trains. Too. <laughs> me too, honey. <laughs> we. Uh oh, there it goes. Okay. Oh. It is you. It sure is, yo. It sure uh, is, yo. I did, I was all professional and did have this all set up before the stream, but uh, Streamlabs has decided to just throw all its toys out the pram and just go, nah, don't wanna. I don't, I don't want that. I don't like that. Fair enough. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Well, oh, no, nah, that's perfect. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ideal. <laughs> Oh, so uh, I wanted to get a tiny bit of housekeeping done, but unfortunately I've been distracted by a million things happening at once, which is great. <laughs> Cora, thank you for the 10 bits, hell yeah. Cora, thank you for the Giffy Subby as well. Fuck yes. Ah, oh, Giffy Subby, Giffy Subby. Wow. <laughs> so happy, yeah. So, um, yeah, we're going to be playing some Shadowgate today. It's a cool uh, retro? style game it's pretty old i <clears throat> i played this game when i was a kid i got it for the game boy color when hmm. um i was like 10 <laughs> 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 i i have little confidence in that <clears throat> i was in the hopsicle for some stuff and i got this to to help me recuperate and it mm -hmm. scared the shit out of me because i was a scared little child uh -huh. but it was also very good um and <laughs> they they redid it the whole thing on steam so we're gonna do the remake yeah. of that. absolutely i'm looking forward to it i've never played this before in my entire goddamn life so Cor yeah, why, been... <laughs> why would you want to ban giffy subby Giffy Subby, uh, Giffy Subby! Ah. Uh, it's just nice, it's cute. <laughs> or is it too twee for your sensibilities? My favorite Pokemon. <laughs> um, so, I, I do want to just, uh, on the subject of word bands, I do want to mention that, um, okay, maybe you don't have sensibilities, whatever. Uh, we have increased the cost of the word bands because holy shit, y'all! <laughs> they now cost a hundred thousand beans because Our... somebody kept banning the word the. <laughs> Our dictionary had become kind of a police state there for a little while. So <laughs> the Krug stream bit is old. Holy shit! <laughs> like We're it's prehistoric. The Paleolithic. It's so prehistoric, we we can't keep bringing Krug back. The timeline is in tatters as it is. <laughs> Please let Krug die. <laughs> I mean, Krug is already dead. Krug back in Paleolithic times. <laughs> Krug's like 16, he's so old for a caveman. Uh -huh. oh. 
Okay, that was the one... Well, okay, no, there's other bits of housekeeping I would like to get out of the way, uh, and that is just... Uh, we're trying to get some more subscribers over on YouTube as well, uh, so, hey, uh, if you want to head over there and hit the sub button, um, that would be absolutely amazing, and it would give me a little shot of serotonin. Mm. I, mean, I mean, it was fun while it lasted. It was amusing, but, uh, you know, we gotta, we gotta give it a rest. We gotta put us away in the girl stream team vault for a little bit. It's got to sit in the proofing oven for a little while, or it's going to get all weird and lumpy. Yeah. And if anyone really wants to spend their beans on it, then, you know. He still they can. can. <laughs> it's going to suck to save that many, but... Uh-huh. All right. Oh, how about that Junji Ito comment today? Um, I believe that I made our position clear in my reply. Uh, we hate that. Um, so, we've, we've set most everything to retro because the uh, modern version kind of chugs balls remake a bit. Remake is bad. <laughs> the remake is bad as it turns out. Um, the, the reason we haven't set graphics to normal, so let me show you the title screen just real <laughs> quick. Look at this title screen. Thing. Look at this title screen. It's fine. It looks okay. It's all good. So let's, let's uh, change it to retro, I guess, and see what like. Okay, our settings have been saved. Alright. Ah, oh, look how oh, retro that is! Dang! Just like pixel art. Just like pixel art, except... It's just like pixel art. Oh. I mean, honestly, this isn't even that bad, but once you get into the game proper, it's just such a completely incomprehensible <laughs> pixel mess. They clearly just... Ugh. Yeah. I, I kind of hope Unnatural 20 is here to be just <laughs> fucking offended by this. It's pretty upsetting. See, the first game is old. Like I, I had it on the Game Boy Color, but it was I think it was like a DOS game before that. I think the Game Boy Color was a port. So yeah, it like, was this is an ancient or, game. DOS or something like that. Uh, it might have been an MSX game, because I think it uh, was in the Japanese PC scene. Yeah. I, but we've yeah. got like we've got the original soundtrack at least, which is has so much of the atmosphere in it. And I, I never like you know, they did like a reorchestrated mix, you know, of all the music, which is fine or whatever, but it never captures any of the punchiness or any of the, like, I don't know, the, the core of what all that chip music sounded like. So I'm, gl I'm glad we at least get that. Yeah, sorry, it is going to go quiet occasionally when I have to click out to tend to something. There we go. So I guess without further ado, let's just get into it. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Normal or classic? New to first person adventures does not require deep knowledge of the Shadowgate universe. Well, I don't think we need a deep knowledge of. Yeah. There's a gate and it's hard to see. Okay, yeah. Or whatever. Okay, gameplay is challenging, provides the longest time limits, direct distance, and fewer opportunities to die. Uh, more challenging. I feel I don't like know which one is closest to the original, but hmm. I would, yeah, okay. <laughs> so we could do Journeyman or, or Master. I think either one would be entertaining, but probably not Iron Man mode. Yeah. Okay, let's do Master <laughs> then. Cool. Just to fucking go all out. All right. That's a name. Uh -huh. Could it not be As so you enter more? a place both familiar and strange. Mm -hmm. In dreams, How is the audio, by the way? Uh, our voices good? Game good? Right south, boy. Take but a and, uh, and a torch. yes. Uh, familiar with data. Ride south from we are familiar with data. the southern arm. <laughs> One is my name, the other is not. I believe in the in the Game Boy version, or maybe the original version, it really just started you in front of the castle, and it's like, you got paid to kill this wizard, go fucking kill him. <laughs> so I don't know what any of this stuff is, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> Find my stone. It's in my kidney. Jesus, Cora. Gatekeeper, the oldest 
spires. It harbors that which oh, has been gaslight so gatekeep girl boss. <laughs> a mountain called and gatekeeper. Oh dear. Shadow gate. The living castle. Oh, this castle's living? That's cool. Yeah, the castle's kind of alive. Oh, neat. So are we just by going inside of it, are we getting bored by the castle? I guess we kind of are. A blight upon us. He has oh, I'm so excited to misremember so much about this game. <laughs> I'm excited too. You're gonna cause my death so many times. Ah, oh, you are gonna die. of the circle of twelve. It is there that you will find this. I'm a crusty old wizard. That you will find Hand me a beer and some potato chips before so, I take my leave. Are we all in agreement that that um, was fucking nothing? Yeah, that was all. That was completely irrelevant bullshit. Go kill the bad guy. Is the plot of this game? <laughs> that you will find yourself with Lackmere's words echoing around your head. You stumble a bit until the world ceases its lurching. You stand before the gaslight gatekeep girl boss mountain. An ornate door framed by a series of skulls is fashioned into the rock wall. Neat. Uh. Yeah. So suddenly, this is less of a castle and more of a mountain, but. You know what? Whatever. As the flame of the torch comes okay. in contact with the skin, burnt smell of burnt flesh fills your nostrils. Oh, neat. I didn't Try die. It again. Right. Oh, hang on. I that can... was fun. Use thyself. Oh, it's just like hey, you're all leaving a deep imprint. <laughs> you don't taste very good. It tells you to give up this course oh. of action. What okay, if... yeah. Well, maybe if you cook yourself a little more, <laughs> then you'll be tastier and you can eat more. Oh, that's true, yeah. Uh, this is the secret puzzle. What <laughs> <laughs> accomplish that? Is. Fucking evil warlocks peeping out of his, like, spire window or something. He's like, what the... What the fuck? Are you... Are you... Hey, are you good there, man? What are you doing? A rather irritated voice emanates from the skull on the ground. About time you got here. Pick me up and let's start this quest of yours. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> I'm busy. <laughs> It's me, I'm the hint thing that they put into this version of the game. Oh, you touch the burning flame Ooh. of the torch to your body, giving yourself some very nasty second-degree burns. Very <laughs> nasty. Skull on the ground clothes before picking your <laughs> you up in the clear voice. Come on, boy, pick please, me up! Please stop being mesmerized by the torch. You touch the flaming torch to your hair and manage to set it on fire. Unfortunately, it's too spreads the rest of your body. A charred husk is all that was left. Dang, you get... You get three attempts, and then you're just like... <laughs> Strike three on trying to burn yourself with a torch. <laughs> Tales of your great sacrifice will be told throughout the land. <laughs> really? You sacrificed your whole body. <laughs> Maybe he was supposed to do that? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, well, yeah, there's... So that's blocks. Shadowgate, there's everyone. Ways you can... <laughs> Dumb ways to die. Oh no, are we gonna have to <laughs> tell me we can skip the intro? Yep. Okay, good. Those are how to find yourself up of a lurching rock wall, <laughs> and that's what would happen if you just try to hold your torch upside down. Can I just oh, we get a map? Oh, this is a game for babies now. What the fuck? There's, There's no, no way, way to... to open thyself. I disagree. There's simply no way to close thyself. Take thyself. You already own thyself. Oh. Hey, use yourself. Use yourself on what? Yourself. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Ow. <laughs> this girl's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Tara Skull... really wants you to eat the torch now. Skull's like, stop hitting yourself! Stop hitting yourself! <laughs> you can't eat that. I'm I'm sad yeah, about cool. that. I know. Where where do we see our like health points? Do we have health points? You don't really have traditional health, no. Okay, I guess let's look at this skull because Oh. Come on boy, I haven't got all day. Pick me up! Uh, I guess look at skull? Look, skull. 
blue forms with me, I got to the bleach skull. Come on, boy, I haven't got all day. Pick me up. Okay, sure, sure, sure. Take skull. Drop the skull when it starts to speak. About time, boy. You have no idea how long you've been here. You can call me... Yorick. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, yes. I have no recollection of how I got here, but I do know plenty about this castle. If you need help on this quest of yours, just speak to me and I'll give you a hint. Yeah, he's the, he's the easy mode that wasn't in the original game. Yorick quickly comes alive. Hey, if you're hungry, take a bite out of something else. I think you can hit him to get him to stop giving you hints relentlessly. Oh. <laughs> you just hit him and he's like, fine, I'll shut up then, jeez. Be in your satchel. It does look a little like bread, but you can't eat the key. It won't taste very good. In an invitation of several mummers you've seen at the fair, you attempt to swallow the blade. Fortunately, you only succeed in slicing your tongue. <laughs> Dang, okay, neat. Uh, well, what else we got here? Thick green roots twist through the dense foliage. Do we want to keep trying to eat the sword? We probably should try to keep eating our sword. Uh, 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 slicing your tongue. No, I, 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 I am, I am pretty sure that you can use a sword on self. Do you attempt to shove Jorik into the slot? His eyes blaze. <laughs> You'll not be putting me back there. <laughs> so there's more suited to that task. Relent the skull blades heat up uncomfortably. Oh. Dang, bud, I'm just trying to solve a puzzle here. Jeez. Door's locked. Okay, so I guess they just left the key under the skull. <laughs> You know, Warlocks just left the key to the front door under this little skull in the garden. Just in case. Okay, finally we solved the first puzzle. We're off the first All screen. Right. Oh, without warning, a pair of glowing eyes filled the chamber. Was a fool oh. to send a child to do that, which it says that the vaunted circle of twelve could not contain my growing power. Come if you wish. It makes little difference. Seal your fate within this living castle of the dead. Me? I guess he's... Yeah. He's the bad guy. <laughs> guess he must be. The apparition fades, leaving a trail of cold air behind it. Neat. Neat. Okay. Uh... Where's save? I'll be righteous right now. There Good we go. idea. Probably gonna want multiple save slots. So, um, game mechanic time, game mechanic time, game mechanic time. Uh, you'll wanna take those torches because your torch will burn out, and if you run out of torches, you die. Oh, neat. Okay. If you run out of torches, you immediately stub your foot and fall over and split your head open and die. <laughs> torches flame and also, momentarily flicker. When it starts to sputter, it, the music gets really, really, really scary. Oh. You fumble about trying to do something constructive with the antechamber. Very quickly, you give up. <laughs> with the whole room at once. Cool. But there's a lever! I want to use the lever! Nope. <gasps> Skill of protest, the lever begins to move. A few moments later, a stone slides away from the wall, revealing an opening that holds a key. Me! You can maybe backwards eat the lever and it would work. <laughs> um, you mean eat some of my butt? Uh-huh. Oh. You gotta intimidate the warlock. You gotta make him afraid to fight you at the end. I'll say. <laughs> it's like, okay, what the fuck? You've been desecrating every inch of this guy. I don't even want it anymore. Fucking gross. It's yours now. I'm going. <laughs> Hatch is magically sealed. It's magically sealed. Yeah, a low hum of power emanates from beneath. Yes, this is a dungeon stench of mildew emanates from the wet dungeon oh, walls. Gross. <laughs> Strange pattern, unlike anything you've seen before, is carved into a solid iron door. Okay, well, we've got two. Yeah, bread key was the front door. Yeah. With both hands to turn the key in, a in the stubborn lock, a satisfying click echoes through the chamber. 
Boy, you'd better be paying attention to that failing torch you're holding. If I might give you some advice, make sure you have enough lit bombs to light before it goes out. Hit, hit Yorick for me, please. You don't, we don't need his advice. <laughs> all right, already. If you wanted me to pipe down, you could have said so. I'll keep my comments down to a minimum. That being said, uh, the torch can be a useful object as well. She said, hinting, hintiously. Hmm, okay. Well, that didn't do anything. Hmm. 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 Could be into chamber at large. Well, what looks flammable? Uh, I mean, I have torches. Well, yeah, but what other than the torches here looks flammable? Uh, oh, I, I guess the rug. Neat. <laughs> Vandalism! Cool! <laughs> Rug person. Oh, it's vandalism. Rug person to play with Sunday Cloud. Smoke up towards the vaulted stone ceiling. <laughs> I don't think that accomplished much unless those cool rocks weren't there before. Those cool rocks were not there before. Oh, and they're, they're cool gold rocks, I they're see. Ex they're exchange o rocks. <laughs> that torch of yours needs attention, boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So do we have to manually replace Torch? We might do. I don't know how it works on this. There we go. Yeah, that's nice. Nice and bright. Oh, cool. I want to touch oh, that book. It's fucking Shadowgate. I want to save my game and touch that book. <laughs> wow, what could possibly be wrong with the book? <laughs> uh, oh, okay. So you lift the tome from the altar, the earth rumbles beneath your feet. In an instant, the rock floor gives way, sending you tumbling down, tumbling down, tumbling down, a long vertical shaft. The abrupt impact from the landing doesn't kill you. Ten tons of stone from the broken floor finish the job. Now, that wasn't really what I was expecting to happen, considering <laughs> there was just a dude there who was very dead. Yeah, he, he didn't quite okay. make it to the, the book death, I guess. Mm -hmm. Isn't there supposed to be like a stats screen here or something? Oh, maybe. Oh. Maybe they haven't had enough. Yeah, let's go back options. to <laughs> let's go back to Alcove. Cove. Oh, okay, uh, so, uh, what if we eat the book? Your hunger for knowledge is admirable, there's a better way to achieve it. Fair enough. <laughs> the skeleton, a quick once over, you find no obvious curse cause of death. You do have a bad feeling about this. That's pretty well, fair. Let us eat the book. The stench of a magical curse is overwhelming and compelling. You decide to let the dead be. Okay. Sure, I guess. Neat. Well, here's something. Oh, it's secured with a dab of candle wax. <laughs> I need arms. I yeah, need arms shit, so I yeah. can use them. Use, use dab on your... Please stop that. <laughs> stop dabbing on me. What are you doing? Uh, hit. Ah! Nice. I Pain. did uh, hit. Reward. Rock fractures and crumbles revealing an opening. I want to eat that it's scroll crumbles. with my mind. Might uh, in your archive. Look. Okay, open then. Smart ass game. Uh -huh. Fandral, this. Do you wish you had a bigger bampus? 
<laughs> you read the message scroll in the scroll. Fandral, this missive is of utmost importance. We must needs coordinate our efforts. Seek my obelisk in the acolyte den below the sewers. I fear the worst is upon us, but I have plans in motion that may yet avert disaster. It is signed with the name Lachmere. Okay, neat. Cool. That's the cool wizard who is kind of just narrating to us. What yeah. is this? Is there a little sum there? Yeah, it did, uh, the pizza hooded figure of the dark and bizarre. Pizza hooded? What? <laughs> <laughs> the pizza hooded. <laughs> I heard you say pizza hooded. Oh. It kind of looks like a Grim Reaper with like a smaller Grim Reaper coming out of the hood a little bit. It does a little bit. I did think that was a little <laughs> guy. Yeah. We take these candles? I'd like these candles. You can sure try to take the candles. Well! <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, honey! Oh, you are having some trouble. Oh, no. Oh, God. Not again. Oh, oh no. Sp Spamton, stop. Oh. You have to stop, Spamton. Oh, change your expression. Maybe that'll help. Oh. God, oh, what's getting worse? What is, what is happening? It's normal. Um, um, whoa, whoa, you guys, I've gone to vaporwave hell. Okay, we can oh, see your eyes. Hang on. <laughs> okay, that's something, right? <laughs> it's fine. Normal, normal and good. <laughs> you a young wrong, priest but... and an old priest. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, let me let me turn you off again, uh, off and on again. Oh, oh, there you go. <laughs> oh, don't warn me before you turn me off. That hurt. <laughs> oh, I didn't even have to break rule three to do that. Oh, good. Jeez. <sighs> My, my super secret special scares for Chad, that's all that was. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you're back. I was... I was afraid. <laughs> okay, right, well... Take this. Take this. Take this. Hit that. Eat that. <laughs> this is like Groundhog Day. Grandfather would roll in his grave if you knew you were contemplating cannibalism. Well, Grandpa, it's a different age. Why Grandfather specifically? Was he cannibalized? Oh, maybe. Read the message. Blah, 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 blah. Seek my obelisk. It says Lackmere. Love, Lackmere. Love, hugs, and kisses, Lackmere. Okay, uh... Can we go left or right? Or is it... Only through um, here? Uh, you should be able to go right. I think left is back. I think I think back is back. Back might be back. Ooh, I'm not gonna be able to help you with this map. It's all new to me. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I remember this. Oh, a skull. <laughs> Yours. You got a girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Uh. Oh, there's stuff kind of falling from the roof. I'm sure that's fine. Yeah. Second tier satchel. You just take that rib cage as well. <laughs> Two bones that clack together. Thoroughly rattled. You choose not to stir the skeleton. Guess that's fair. Your stomach rolls and lurches at the thought of picking sinew and meat from between your teeth. Ew. Hmm. Huh? Whoop. I suppose I should save it's probably in a new damp, slot. Musty bees waft out from behind. Oh door. no! Not the daft, <laughs> the daft musty bees. <laughs> Card carry <laughs> member of the Donner Party. Ah, oh, skulls, skulls aplenty. Oh boy, Yurik, it's a whole family for you, guy. The figure moves within the opening. You hear the unmistakable twang of a longbow followed by the whistle of an arrow. Instinctively jerk to the left, you see the glint of silver as the arrow misses you and strikes the rock behind you, sh shattering into splinters. I'm sure that's fine. That's definitely normal. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Yorick shouts out a warning. Hey boy, did you see some movement in the shadows? Yeah, okay, I guess I'll go. I've probably got enough skulls <laughs> at this point. Okay, well. I sure do have a... Oh, they're all oh, different, mostly. Such an assortment of skulls. Okay, this is... Yellowed with age and replete with long hairline cracks. This one is shivers run down your spine as you look at the teeth marks on the skull. What a terrible way to perish. This particular skull almost looks inhuman. This skull has a deep gouge in the back of its head, a telltale sign of a death blow from an axe. Neat! Cool. You're physically incapable of getting the skull in the slot, it simply will not fit. Special skulls in special places. I guess it has to be fancy skulls. Maybe a whole skull? No, these aren't particularly whole. Noticeable indentation in the archway. Yeah, I'll say. Although, it kind of looks like there's letters on all the other skulls. Is that oh, it? yeah. A little bit. Gazing at the etchings upon this skull, your vision momentarily fades. There's something strangely hypnotic about the thing. Sense of despair. Imprisoned in the archway. Okay, yep, and yep. I'm not going to tell us what the letters are. Well, hard to tell if this is an actual skull or a carving of a skull. Take a look at the back of your mind. It's almost as if the skull is trying to bore its way inside. Neat! Several scrapes, scratches, and gnaw marks on the skull, almost as someone or something was trying to pry it free. Ooh, see if you can use your, your sword on the one that looked like it was going to be pried free. Ooh, yeah. Um, low thrum of power comes from a strange skull. Oh, maybe these are just randomized descriptions? Oh, possibly. Yeah, I think they are. Okay. I'll try using sword on skull in the end, in any case. So you can like lever it out. Skull. This particular skull is lodged firmly in the archway. Well, we're gonna have to use Dirk Strider on every skull. Oh beans. <laughs> oh beans. Man, I love fucking retro adventure games. And it's definitely gonna be the very last skull, or not at all. Yeah. Love to pick a skull. Okay, I think we've tried all the skulls at this point. Yeah. Okay, fuck this. <laughs> What's really exciting, by the way, is that I can't see your cursor. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's on stream, but it's not on my stream. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> so. that one. Sweet. Okay. Alright. Yeah, places to go and things to be. Ah, teeth chattering. You stand within the cold cellar, hugging yourself for warmth. The creature made of ice hovers playfully on the far side of the room. Hey, bud. Hey, Knowing what to say, you introduce yourself to the element. The creature replies by blowing air in your face. Well, Ooh. okay. Uh, use torch on... Yeah! Thrust the lit torch into the ice. After a moment, it begins to melt. We're finally reviewing the key it had encased. I did not think that was gonna fucking work. Hey, Mel! Nice. nice, nice, nice. Oh, there's, a, there's a scroll in that one. Yeah. What's the thing up top that looks like a spider? Oh! 
frozen mass, perhaps that of a massive arachnid is encased in a thick layer of ice. You shake your head, wondering what the thing is and how it got into its predicament. <laughs> Just gonna say real quick. Just real quick. I think it was much too small to melt the ice and free the creature. Okay, I guess I'm okay Good. with that. Good. For the best. Okay. Let's see. I want to see what that other scroll is. Open. Ah, oh, you unroll the scroll and it's written in... Oh! So you scan the scroll, one particular word almost seems to jump out at you. Agape. 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 Uh, what time is it, Carmela? Please tell me what time it is, I say with steepled fingers. And feebled stingers. <laughs> well, we'll wait for that to resolve itself. Uh, in your mind's eye, you see a glyph. Oh, it's dimmer time! Ah, oh, okay. Oh, time dimmer. Uh, in your mind's eye, you see a glyph glowing with power and quickly write down the strange marking in your spellbook. Before the scroll crumbles in your hands, you realize that you have learned a spell. Me! Ah, oh, watch what happens when I cast a spell I don't know. <laughs> Spellglyph translates the word agap. Well, okay. Sense a huge weight <laughs> like a stone opening itself to some mystery beyond. Okay. Uh... Magic flies about in a spectacular fashion but does little else. It sounds like maybe it's like, make something heavy. Cast it on the spider, see if you can make it crunch to the ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That seems like a good idea. Surely it's dead, right? With your will and picture you with a glyph in the mind, closing your eyes, you release a spell, expecting something wonderful to happen. Nothing does. Okay, maybe that's not what that does then. Well, let's uh, use uh, the Freezy Keezy on this door. There's no lock in which to. Oh! Well, it's just open the whole time. Oh, uh, later. Oh, there's a fucking <laughs> nerd skull in there. <laughs> Mister, rush from the room before the dragon can release a blast of fire. What you having for dinner there, Carmela? Large cavern, you find yourself on the shore of a placid underground lake. You know, perfectly oh. pl placid, normal, ordinary. Yeah, normal, regular. It's hard to tell from this distance, but you think you see a skeleton chained to a rock. <laughs> you think. Yorick, was this your skeleton bones? <laughs> Some waterfall empties out to the lake. Oh, it looks quite nice. Like, I think yeah. the torch is kind of guttering a little bit, maybe? A Not little, sure. A little bit. Not too bad yet. Like we're not getting it, the uh, messages. It should get, right. give you like warning music when it when it's getting time to change it. I think we don't want to be yeah. too premature lest we run out early. You little hello to the skeleton. The hey. echo in the chamber <laughs> sends chills down your spine. Oh hey Iggy. Oh Ooh. thank you for coming around to show your support. Curving set of stairs lead up into the darkened passage. Magnificent <laughs> waterfall cascades from the mouth of an ancient stone statue, painstakingly carved into the cavern wall. Below it, an undulating mass of water hovers playfully above the river. Oh, that's hey. a bad way to describe water. Hey, bud! Oh, you bow and introduce yourself to the elemental. It playfully dances away, squirting you with water. Neat. Entity made entirely of water and mist. The liquid elemental continuously forms, reforms in a hypnotic way. Eat. That won't accomplish anything. <laughs> oh. This marking looks like a dwarven craftsman stamp. Wow. Eat. That won't accomplish anything. Won't um, accomplish my hunger. Nope, that's... Uh... 
Speaking to the waterfall accomplishes nothing. Okay, eat the waterfall. Apart from your adventure, you got down some of the fresh water. <laughs> Neat! <sighs> okay, it is starting to get a little dark, I think. Yeah, it is, actually. There we go. That's, That's nice. Better. And I can't help but feel that um, the pixely version would be less of an object hunt than this. Like, not the pixely version that's in this game, because that looks like pure garbage, but... <laughs> yeah, the, the actual, like, original art. Yeah, I think it, it absolutely would be. Yeah. Well, I can tell you that there's some things you can actually do in that room with the Dagron. Yeah, I did see a shield and stuff, and I think I might want to just snag that and go real fast. Yeah. If I remember correctly, if you get the shield first... Whoop! Then you're fine. But it's a scorching stream of fire. It didn't sound very fine. Bigger than you thought possible. Flame engulfs you. Oh, your flesh is seared from your bones. You have oh, died. Oh dang! I thought okay. I got. I thought I did it fast. That's interesting. Yeah, I remember that being like you get the shield first, and then you have a few chances to grab other shit in that room before it melts the shield completely. And I mean, maybe, maybe it's not. maybe it's just because I bugged the fuck out of the room the first time around. Well, maybe. Dragons! Dragons! Dragons. I think we also didn't go in one of these directions yet, so... That's true, let's check this place out. Oh, neat. Stone tombs lining the walls of this musty crypt. There is an ancient, almost reverent air to this place. Oh, and the torches in here are fucking enormous! Yeah! Look at those things, dang! Like other torches you see in these caves, this torch is welded into a bracket. Oh. Well, you did. Oh, you yank on the torch, pulling it downwards. Oh. Ooh. As you might, you can't pull the torch downwards. It appears to be stuck in place. to live this tomb has a mischievous feral look to it. Me. A distinct noble looking warrior has been carved in this sarcophagus. Mm. Cow alleged shadowy figure is carved on the lid of this crypt. The likeness of a regal figure has been engraved on the lid of this tomb. A bas relief carved on the tomb is of an ancient figure brandishing a sword. Well when you open the tomb, a horrific creature is released, letting oh. in a piercing cry that cuts into your very being. It's a banshee, harbinger of death and disease. You feel a momentary stabbing pain for the spectre winks out of existence. I seem to be okay. Yeah. I just gave you a little spook. Ancient doors encircle a small hallway. Whoa, that was intense. Whoa. Yeah. Remains are wrapped in very old linen cloths. So you're surprised you can still smell the nauseating odor of embalming fluid. You attempt to undo the wrappings but fail to find the beginnings of the benches. Set it on fire? I'm gonna use sword. Oh yeah, that could work. Oh, yeah. Surprisingly, the wrappings resist your efforts to cut them. Okay, fire That's then. Surprising. <laughs> Which wrappings quickly go up in flames as the mummy is consumed. A sword that was buried inside is revealed. Ah, oh, sweet! Ah, oh, a better sword. Oh, it's a big fucking sword. You put the sword in your satchel. The BFS. <laughs> it is. Oh no, it's it's not quite the same exact <laughs> oh sword. Oh my god! But it's, it's almost very close. <laughs> this long sword is ornately carved and of excellent craftsmanship. The blade looks dulled by age. Rusted and pitted dirt looks as if it's seen better days. 
Okay, Terrell says, nah, it's fine, keep opening the tombs. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. Slides open with a grating moan. Moan. <laughs> I thought that was the <laughs> Lid slides open with an eerie creep. Lid opens with an eerie creep. Huh? How about this one? How eerie. Right open the crypt, it is fused shut. I guess let's mm -hmm. use torch on. <laughs> Burn some mummies. Oh, an amazing gold scepter and leather sack fall to the ground. We actually picked cool. up a leather sack earlier, didn't we? Oh, yeah. I should open that and see what's in there. Where is that? It's. Oh, there it, it is. Hiding! It was hiding! This guy has a skull. <laughs> <laughs> you rummage through the oh. sack, finding dice and a scroll. Taking these, you discard the sack. God. I thought it turned into. I thought there was a skull in it. The way the items shifted over, <laughs> I'm like great. Dice like these are typically used by fortune tellers. Each face of the dice contains a different symbol, though, and rolled can divine one's future. Neat. Yeah, <laughs> the symbols are one through twenty. Oh, hello. The danger is real. While the oh. writing is difficult to discern, you manage to glean a few key phrases. The danger is real. Alert the surrounding lands. Seal off the passages into the Gatekeeper Mountains. The wax seal shows an eagle in flight and is signed by someone named Fandril. Oh, sweet. Good for him. Got some cool loot for for grave robbing. Yeah. What is this? Grave robbing is lucrative. Ancient symbol showing two griffins locked in deadly combat is carved on this gem encrusted scepter. Merge through the thick burlap and find a scroll. You take this while discarding the sack. Okay. Hey, you knowing it might be important, you carefully unroll the scroll. Handwritten scroll is faded and difficult to read, but you can make it one passage. When M Majal's tail lights the northern skies, the alignments are in apogee, then shall the eagle appear watched over by the all-seeing eye. The nourishment of water shall quench the tree only to be overrun by fire. Incomprehensible. Have a nice day. Sure. Okay, find a tree, get it wet, then burn it, I guess. Mm -hmm. Beneath an eagle or something. Things are so dry and they. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, hey, he's got a mark on his. No, oh, along with a scroll that escaped the fire. Got the skull and feel a faint trace of power coursing through it. Okay. See, when Terrell said, nah, it's fine, keep opening the tombs, I thought that I was going to die. <laughs> the other ones are all going to be full of zombies. Mm -hmm. uh drawing of a castle with a single tall spire in the center has been scrawled on this parchment. A single line points to the exact middle of the tower, and next to it, these words. Three times right, then once pulled down. Twice past midnight points the ruined crown. Light becomes dark, the king sits the throne. The masked one revealed shall mark the stone. Okay, so I think that's the lever puzzle? <laughs> that sounds like a... yeah. It's some kind of puzzle for sure. Uh, sack middle of the tower next to it. Where's my note? Probably have to get to the middle of the tower. I mean, this. Is right. I, I guess there? maybe it might not be for this room specifically. Yeah. But like it does say, three times right, then once pulled down. And it talks about light becomes light. dark. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably fine. It's probably fine. The ancient wrapping quickly go up in flames. As the mummy burns, a shield that was wrapped inside falls to the floor. Shield in your satchel. Okay. I feel like they changed that. I would have bet money that you're, you were originally supposed to just get the shield out of Dragon Room, but whatever. This hefty wooden shield has withstood the year as well. Use shield? Use the shield on what? On me. You lash the wooden shield securely to your forearm. Hell yeah. Okay. All right. Now we're in business. Shield business. Shield business. You know, I haven't tried speaking to this guy. Hey, bud. I'm almost like this skeleton. Your light like, up. You shouldn't speak to the dead. Wait. Wait a minute. Really? Cora uh, takes on speaking to the dead. 
is this? A faint hum of power rises from the strange symbol on the skull's forehead. The mark doesn't appear to be carved, but rather fused into the bone. Neat. What's that mean? I don't know. Surprised that the skull resists your attempts to place it into the slot. Okay, maybe a different slot? Okay, after a puzzle moment or two, uh -huh. we'll try. How about this one? Yeah! The skull snaps out of your hand into the slot in the archway. It's a brief glow and a thrum of power fills the air. Something just beyond the door seems to come alive. Cool. Hey, can you hack at the at the like vines covering uh, Big Skull? I guess let's find out. Actually, yeah. Let's use this big sword of ours. Oh, oh, it's a helmet. Oh, hey, you knew that, right? <laughs> Drop the helm into your satchel. Oh, torch's flame momentarily flickers. Do some stuff out there. I'm glad you're egging me on there, Terrell. It's the oversized helm on your head. It is so large and really obscures your vision. Oh, you look like you do fishes. Mm-hmm. Okay. I think that was good. We should probably save. We should. I'd like a quick save. Oh, maybe? Ba -da -ba, ba -da. Oh, yep, F5, F9. Okay. Good. I guess the shield might let us get past the arrow friend in here. Or the shot, right? Yeah. Force yourself through the narrow opening and into the darkness beyond. Bigger moves within the opening at the back of the grotto. You hear the unmistakable twang of a longbow, followed by the whistle of an arrow. Raise your shield at the last possible moment. The arrow bounces off the wood and lands unharmed on the ground at your feet. Neat! Now we have an arrow. Cool. <laughs> Just return to the Build a Boy workshop. <laughs> it's a bonanza. Ah. Look at the bones! Oh, hey, bud. Oh Your chicks in warning. Hey, boy, did you see movement in the shadows? Yeah, I did. Yeah, we have a shield. Yeah. That's existential. Practice nice splinter guess. bones in the ribcage reinforce just how frail life is. Eat the campfire. Our passage leaves downward. Okay. You can't eat that. God, look at the fire sprite on top of the log sprite. I know, I yeah, know. It's so bad. Oh. Why didn't they just let us have the original graphics? Stand at the edge of a lava filled chasm. Possible as it seems, the faint, terrified screams of some unfortunate souls echo within its depths. Cool. I want that skull. There is no way to take the chasm. Oh. <laughs> Jiggle Bones Bridge. Yeah, there's like two bridges. There's a good bridge and a bad bridge. <laughs> but do you th only think that the good bridge is the good bridge? I Maybe know, right? It's trapped and the bad bridge is the good bridge. You recognize the name Majal amongst the hard to decipher language. Oh yeah, like the Taj. No. <clears throat> The you sniff the crinkled ancient paper. <laughs> well, ah, oh, oh, book smell. Library. And it's the longest guys. No, but 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 but. Okay, this is nothing. Do just have a lot of bones. Yeah, we should do, huh? Jinga's arrow looks a bit tattered, but silver arrow tip looks to be in good condition. I don't know why we don't have a fifth tab that's just body parts. <laughs> I know, right? Some hatless per- that's a lot of leg bones to have. Mm hmm But not as many as you would expect given the number of skulls that there are. Mm-hmm. The workmanship of this stone bridge seems quite sturdy. 
The rickety bridge is held together with nothing but frayed rope and rotten wood planks. As if in warning, a mounted skull spans guard in front of it. Cool. <sighs> well, chat, I mean, I'm gonna go across the, the good bridge. Oh! Oh, hello. Huh. A dense fog greets you as the stone passage opens into a small chamber. Temperature plummets as a creature materializes in front of you. Hey, bud! Wraith doesn't hear you. Oh, that's the bad torch music. Sure did get cold in here. Cold and dark. <laughs> I told you the bad torch music was bad. It is real bad. <laughs> it's a bad time. <laughs> Bridge creaks and sways under your weight on Thorn and you take two more steps for it. Well, I mean, I guess that figures. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look, you, you turn into a skull on your little portrait when you die. That's oh. <laughs> Can you put that in your inventory before you die? <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. Here's an existential question for chat. Is your skull part of your inventory? Oh. Like in real life? <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Is it a part of your inventory? Because it's yours, you have it, and you're bringing it with you wherever you go, I hope. <laughs> I like to leave mine at home so. sometimes. Okay, I think we had to read up our torch, so let's do it's it. It's a key item, says Daryl. <laughs> oh my <fair>. god! <laughs> oh, the Triforce. <gasps> there it is. Wraith remains rooted in place. Take the torch. Take the torch. Does he have much to say? He does not. He just fucking ignores us. That's not very nice. Look. Even though you've never seen one before, you know this is a shadow wraith. A being that walks the line between life and death, between light and shadow. I guess... Watch what happens when I cast a spell I don't know. Oh yeah. <laughs> Gape the wraith. As you approach the wraith, its body turns to vapor. A heartbeat later, the thing's body reforms. The temperature drops a few more degrees. It's maybe more difficult than you thought. Can you torch him? Can you just, if he's a creature of light and shadow, can you remove the shadow? You plunge the lit torch into the ethereal form of the wraith. It wraps its icy tendrils around the flame, putting it uh -oh. out with a hiss. Uh -oh. oh, we're, we're boned. Wait, no, I we're mean, not. We've got a lot of bones. As you spin around to exit the chamber, you trip and fall headlong towards the floor. Your head impacts the ground so hard that it cracks open, sending blood and grey matter flying in every direction. I did, I did warn you. Oh my god. The second your torch went out, you would immediately trip and fall and split you your head sure open and die. Did. And I was wicked not. You are not, not joking. Oh, uh, hey, Faylar. Uh. A friendly reminder, a group of sharks is a shiver, a group of rabbits is a fluffle, a group of bears is a sleuth, a group of owls is a parliament, a group of flamingos is a stand, and a group of I mean... people is a mistake. <laughs> that was fucking good. Oh, shit. Oh, also, yeah, happy lesbian day, everybody. Oh, yeah. It, it's it's lesbians today. Oh, All sure. lesbians 50% off. Sure is lesbians out. It's, oh, it's, it's, it's lesbians outside. Lesbians with a chance of lesbians. The chance of warlocks. Hmm. There we go. Okay. Right. Okay. Yep. Cool race guy. <laughs> uh -huh. Bo. Bo -bo. Booga booga booga! Sure did get cold in here, cold and dark. Yeah, dude, it sure did, man. Jeez. Boy, it sure is dark in here. This... Okay. Guess we can only have one arrow. Just so. 
Like Never get a response from the cave. Can you piss on the campfire and put them out? Man, that would be a trick, huh? <laughs> Is there a secret piss command? Oh! As you scramble up the rocks, oh. a goblin appears, levels a bow at you and fires. Fortunately, it misses and hits the rocks at your feet. Unfortunately, the arrow ricochets and embeds itself into oh. your left eye. <laughs> that was a needlessly gruesome video game. Thank you. Pity you have failed in your grand quest. <laughs> what a pity that it missed you and then hit you on a rebound. In a way worse place. I know, right? Okay. So I guess... Okay, did I... I did not save. I thought I quick saved after... I'm pretty sure I quick saved after... Yeah. No, apparently not. Okay. Doing this again. <laughs> I want to raise this one more time. It's real quick. Whoa, hot skeleton. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we should do something about that. Also, hey... Laura or Maddie. I'm not sure who's doing the do. Or both. Or possibly neither. You never know. Maybe it's... Oliver. Oh, it's Laura. Ah, oh, it is Laura. Hell yeah. This game is a good one for having hot skeletons in it, I guess. Uh-huh. We've almost built so many boyfriends. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like a little drawing of the giant spider. Oh. It's big giant spider. Forgot. Okay, so there's a cool thing up there. There's a dragon's nest there. Maybe the wooden shield will let us get the better shield in the dragon's nest? I feel like it probably will. Is there fucking... Oh! Ooh. What? Ah. Uh... Hello? Shimmering barrier, lightning-like energy stands between you and the far side of the hall. Quick save. <laughs> You run at the barrier, but the magical wall holds fast, repelling you and knocking you to the floor. Fine. Okay. I don't want to go there anyway. Okay. With all the authority you can muster, you tell the dragon to sit. I can shift it weight and gathers a breath. The roar of the ancient beast released a scorching stream of fire at you. You raise the wood shield, intercepting the blast of fire. Unfortunately, the wooden shield is no match for the beast's superheat and breath. The fire hungrily spreads to your hair, your clothes, your flesh, and mere moments you're nothing more than a charred, lifeless husk. Well, I guess that's fair. Mm -hmm. Dang. This game is stylish. I'm I'm enjoying myself with this. <laughs> oh yeah, we should absolutely just real quick <laughs> show on a retro mode real quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we have a bunch of stuff on retro here, like the commands, the audio, the text. I have to wonder if they rewrote the script for the normal. It's just the font. It's like, does it look like pixel font, or is it just Times New Roman? <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's pretty bad. And uh, graphics. So, it does have retro graphics, and you would think that this would mean, okay, so it's going to use the old-style graphics from from when it was... <laughs> when it was <sighs> first made, but no, instead <sighs> it just goes... <laughs> Instead, the developers just decided, fuck it, we're gonna throw a fucking pixel filter over it. Eat shit, not, idiots. Not everything, not the UI, just the... Yeah. Oh, it's so bad. <laughs> Turned crunchy mode on. Uh-huh. Can I eat the barrier? You can't like eat that. Twi Twitch dial-up connection simulator. Mm -hmm. Teeth. <laughs> Teeth. <laughs> so, what have we here, exactly? We have... Dented helm looks a bit small for you. Can you use shield? What did you try to do last time with the shield? I tried to talk to the dragon. No, no well, the time before that, when you tried to get the shield. Right oh, I tried my... to take shield. See if you can use shield. Shield a lot. 
one dragon. One fluid motion, you unbuckle the wooden shield and strap on the iron shield in its place. Hey. Ah, oh, nice. Okay. So iron shield just in time to block the dragon's flame, dispersing harmlessly to either side of you. Okay, uh... Now, I think we've only got enough time to take a couple things out of here. Oh, this ancient chest is infused together by intense heat. I... Uh... Spear My... appears perfectly balanced. One end has been sharpened to a deadly point. My vague recollection is that we want the spear, the hammer, and the glasses. Okay. And I think that's all we've got time for. Because he's going to go, Bleh! and you're going to be like, no! But you're going to be like, hey! Then your shield's gonna be like, Aah! This time you can actually feel the heat. Was that scrutable at all? Were you able to scoot that? I was oh, able no. to understand what... Oh no. Oh Fair... no. The dragon's fire's <laughs> melted me. Oh no. Help me. <laughs> <laughs> no. Enclosed red hole. <laughs> Please. The skull into your satchel. <laughs> Bail bathes you in a molten stream of scorching oh. fire. You manage to raise your shield in time to deflect the dragon's flame. However, the fire is taking its toll on the shield and it begins to melt. Peace! Time to go. Okay, turn me off and on again, please. Oh. Okay, uh, let's see. Your turn-offs. Uh, I, I look the... kind of like a, like a found footage video a little bit. A I little, what's a happening. little bit, yeah. Your turn-offs, uh, the cops. Hey. Your turn-ons, shark girls. Oh, I'm back, everybody. Hello. Did that work? Am I live? Uh, let's find out. Yeah, there we go. Ah, okay. you're, you're, you're happy and smiling <laughs> and grinning. Good. Ah, I feel much better now. Oh, this shield looks good. You can barely hold on to the charred remains of this iron shield. You don't will have stunned another attack. Okay, the shield looks not good. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that was good though. I'm pretty sure we needed all the, those three things specifically. Okay. Everything else was just we didn't need three more skulls. <laughs> Maybe you didn't. I, I'm, I'm like 98% sure we don't need any of those skulls. Skull has a pair of glasses melted to its head. You can't take something you already own. I mean, I guess that's true. A way to open the skull. Uh, hit it with the hammer? Okay, uh... Nope! The hammer did oh. not do anything to the skull. <laughs> okay, these are not little <laughs> Gasha prize boxes. Oh skulls. my god. Hey, Julie! <laughs> hey, Julie. Can you just, like, use fortune-telling dice on us? Here, so you roll the dice. A pair of identical snake symbols come up. Ugh, why did it have to be snakes? Mm. Can you wedge them into Yorick's eye sockets? That would be fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're gonna poke my eye out! Yorick <laughs> exclaims loudly. I hate that bastard. Sucks so bad. I guess he wasn't in the original. No, he was not. There were no hints in the original. Okay, so we have... It is impossible to do that. But I want to go there very badly. Oh, okay, there we go. I guess the big sparkly field is not so bad, considering... I we got everything from that room, except the switch puzzle? Yeah, except for the switch puzzle. I, f I feel like maybe you're, you're able to open a secret door inside one of those to enter a new room. Mm. But... Yeah, yeah, the, the screen wipes, uh, you, it's actually set up to use the retro transitions and a few other retro things in it. Um, like, by default, they've redone a lot of the stuff badly. Badly. <laughs> Uh, there is a retro graphics mode, which I just showed to everyone, but since Julie just got here, I'll just, uh... <laughs> I'll just pop it on again real quick. Here's retro graphics. Oh, man, just like uh, my Ugh. King's Quests. Ugh. There we go. Oh, you have it. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only person that, that's aware of Shadowgate. Mm -hmm. I'll have to do something with that. Little hatch. Okay. So, 
Can we? You cannot get your fingers around the edges of the skull to take it out. Perhaps there's another way. There we go. Fair enough. You can join us on another adventure for a little while. Yeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure that's what made the funny magic happen. Yeah. Oh, okay. uh, yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember ever playing Shadowgate 64. I, that was during the era where most of my 64 games were rentals. So I, I, I don't know that I ever had access to it, but... A rather odd thing to do. And the right one is stuck, right? The right one, one is very stuck. stuck. Yeah. Can you unstick it? Oh, maybe. Oh no, it's Seven. become spooky festive again. <laughs> Oh my god, why does this keep happening to you? Oh, okay. 3D Maze Walker. Yeah, I, I mean, we were actually discussing Shadowgate 64 just before the stream, and we kind of came to the conclusion that it was probably not good. <laughs> but uh, maybe if it is. If it keeps happening to Spirit Halloween, my movement in your spot. Oh no. Oh, oh no. How about this arrow? It's kind of, uh, good but hard. Okay. We'll do anything constructive to the mausoleum. Well, I, I guess I misclicked if the I'm saying. The Cholian. Effect on the torch. How about the spear? Cut the wood off the torch with the spear for no apparent reason. <laughs> well, that wasn't necessarily what I was hoping to do. Just smack it? Did you smack it already? I smacked it with a hammer. Yeah, I don't seem to have anything to smack or lubricate it with. What did this say? So. Three times right, then once pulled down. Twice past midnight points the ruined crown. Light becomes dark, the king has a throne, the last one's revealed shall mark the stone. I mean, we don't really have any way of putting the torches out either, I don't so... Think there's, yeah, there's not like a, a two o'clock to this whole scene. Yeah. yeah. Have you tried pulling the torch with uh, one or both of the others pulled down? Oh, uh... Is it like, does it have to be in a special order? Wants this one to be down? Nope. Yeah, no, I, I don't know. Maybe there'll be a clue elsewhere, because like this yeah. isn't getting us anywhere. Yeah, let's uh yeah, let's go exploring. Let's get the response from the torch. Understandable. So let's see, what have we got that we can go to and do? We've got the, like, waterfall kind of area. But there's not a lot going on. Hmm. Like... I mean, we've got a lot of items, and I've been like, oh, yeah, cool. I have no idea what I need this for. I don't know what any of this for. <clears throat> Maybe we do need that skull in the thing. That's me. Maybe we'll have to check out Shadowgate 64 then, if, if it was just good but hard. Yeah, hmm. 
Oh, you know what? I didn't actually just try hitting the torch, so... I, I guess let's try that. Like, it seems fucking... Whoa! God! Whoa! <laughs> Excuse me? The room begins to spin and you feel vertigo set in. An apparition appears before your eyes and you hear the echo of the banshees scream in your head. <laughs> why, is, why is the banshee back? But it came upon you, the vertigo recedes and your vision clears. You begin to wonder what the banshee might have done to you. Hey, is my face oh, weird? I think my face is weird. Oh, maybe. Take stock of yourself, concerned about the stabbing pains in your stomach and the spreading green pallor of your skin. However, the iron shield strapped across your arm gives you some measure of comfort. Neat! Okay, well, we maybe screwed <laughs> ourselves already. Hmm. Oh! You hit the torch hard, forcing it downwards. Well, <laughs> son of a bitch. You would think that tap with hammer would do the thing. I guess we hit it too hard with the hammer and nothing <laughs> happened. <laughs> Mark. You jump back as the tomb in the center slowly moves across the floor, revealing a stairway leading down. Down we go. Reminds you the elven funhouse at King Otto's Fair. You remember taking your sister, hoping to lose her in the reflective maze. Okay, well. Hooray. Uh, yoink. Yoink. Congratulations, you've earned the Torchbearer achievement. Neat! Thanks, Jesus, for telling us that. Drop the vial into your satchel. Okay, oh, I think I've run liquid. <laughs> oh, I love unlabeled potion. <sighs> the exception of a crack, the vial is unremarkable in nearly every way. Eat. Potion makes you stronger. Oh, it doesn't have anything in it. <laughs> well, okay. Eat. That will not taste very good. Eat. Eat the boom. That will not taste very good. Um. Uh... Are you a magical broom swallower? He's broom on myself. Mm. Bunch of bristles. Well, okay. Yeah, it's a. It's a broom. Basically, it's a broom. A big rock. That's a pretty big rock. Our rock sits in the center of the room. Is this what we get to cast the spell that I don't know on? <sighs> For a tense moment of holding your breath, you release the spell <laughs> with a word. The magic backfires a spectacular fashion that would be funny if it didn't hurt so much. Oh! <sighs> Ow. In action, the mirror is a distorted image of yourself. Your head looks much larger than the rest of your body. Okay dashing figure you see in the mirror. It bulges out a bit as if something is pushing it from the other side. Awful. And your fingers are on the mirror's frame, looking for hidden latches or releases. Nothing. Although dusty, the surface of the mirror will cast a fine reflection of yourself. Some movement behind your reflection. You jump back in surprise before looking around the room. Surface on this mirror appears warped in an odd way. Either that or your hips really are that big. Ah. Oh. Whoa. I mean, they are, but. Yeah. Well. Well. You nearly time break your to knuckles get... striking <laughs> reflective surface. It fails to shatter. Perhaps it's enchanted in some way. <laughs> oh, it didn't work. It must be enchanted. Oh, the mirror cracks, revealing metal underneath. Ooh. Oh god, I've gone to this spook zone again. Oh my god, why is this happening bleh, to you? Bleh, 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 bleh. Let me power cycle my girlfriend again. Bleh, bleh, bleh. There you are. God knows Whoa. why this keeps happening, because like all I have to do is just refresh <laughs> the, don't really know. the damn thing. Okay. Quick effective jab, the glass shatters with a crash. You break your knuckles, striking the reflective surface. <laughs> In a sparkle and mesmerizing way. Exorcism live on stream. 
I like you've got so many tools you could use to break these. I and you're know. Just using your fists. Absolutely. As hard as you try, you can't open the mirror. Hmm. Just use the femur. It just bounces off the glass. Okay. Uh, use hammer on this one. Ah! Aha! We're back and strike the mirror with the ha hammer. The glass falls away from the frame, revealing a door behind it. Neat. I want to do that again. Oh. It refuses to break any frame. On the door with all your might. Locked door just rattles in its frame. Well, we did find a key earlier, so that surely has to eat the mirror. Attempt to force the key into the lock, but it will not fit. <laughs> I was going to say, you attempt to force the mirror in your mouth. That will not taste very good. I, oh, wow. I'm actually surprised it doesn't let you just eat the glass shards and die. <laughs> that wouldn't be the dumbest way to cause your own death. I know. Colorful prison right in the room. The door waits behind the facade. Strike the door, accomplishing nothing. Great. Um. Maybe the bread key. I think the, the bread key was the was the front door key. Yeah. I'm surprised that key is in it. Can't eat that. Can't eat that. Door doesn't hear you. Okay, so we haven't got the key for this one. Probably. Large boulder has veins of quartz running through it. Ooh. Can you move it? Oh! Oh! Yes, apparently. Uh, yes, you can. See to the bottom of the opening is a metal door locked securely in place. Oh. Huh. There's a metal plate that blocks the way down. Open. Tug on the hatch, but it's not available. It appears to be secured from below. Okay, well. Okay. Finding a handhold, you attempt to lift the rock. You feel something move, but unfortunately it's in your back. Oh! Mm -hmm. Smash the rock pile. The bone jarring hit does little to affect the rock. Okay. Uh... I don't know, let's... Smashy, smashy? Nope. That won't accomplish anything. Alas. Alas. We don't really have any other keys, do we? No. We've got that vial now, so that's... That's true. We did get that. Maybe we fill that with water from Waterfall Place? Give it a shot. Merge the vial in the water. Unfortunately, all the water leaks out of a crack in the bottle. Well, neat. Huh. Useful. Um. You wear this the glasses skull so that you can see through the glasses. I hope so. <laughs> if the skull's big enough. We attempt to pull the glasses from the skull, but they appear to be welded in place. That's a shame. Aww. Try to use the scepter on the elemental, it's effortlessly dense out of your reach. Okay. Torch time. 
Spidey. Yeah, we've looked at that, and not really... It's like a Dwarven Craftsman stamp. I guess? Like, this was a... Finally. Hey, Unnatural 20! Hello! Yeah, Dwarven Hammer and Dwarven Stamp. Uh, on natural 20, now that you're here, I want to just real quick, just real quick upset you a little bit. Uh, because I know that you take pride in your pixel art, and your pixel art's very, very good. And I just want to show you what they thought was acceptable for the... All the differing, differing skulls are very necessary, yeah. <laughs> but incredibly unnecessary. This is, this is what uh, the developers thought was fine for a retro mode for this game. Isn't it beautiful? It's wonderful. It's just like my Super Nintendo. <laughs> it's beautiful, perfect, wonderful. Love it. Hate it. Oh, hang on. Can I take these? Yeah! Oh, good. Good, more bones. <laughs> Look! The developers have to have something in mind. They wouldn't just let me take all these eight leg bones and there various really should skulls. Be more tabs <laughs> to categorize your inventory. <laughs> like a useless bullshit tab? <laughs> Still haven't figured this out. Can you just read the book without taking it off of the thing? I feel like that's going to lead to my death, but... See spell emanating from this book hints at its age. Open? Oh! Welp! Something shifts under your feet as you open the book. It's probably fine. Yeah. You scan the ancient yeah. manuscript, noticing most of the language is ineligible. One particular word stands out from the rest. <laughs> Much Invocan. like that word. <laughs> hey! Your mind's eye, you see a glyph glowing with power and quickly write down the strange mark in your spell, but you've learned a spell. Okay. Dang. That one's almost a, an in intelligible word itself. Mm -hmm. Well, time to use this on everything, I guess. Should we put... Should we put the old old bone boy back in his little home for now because i feel like we're gonna have to at some point and i don't think we can do much else in the the mastacholium right yeah that's true let's go put him in back in his bone home back in his little tantrum hall <laughs> combine skulls oh my god yeah it'll be just like diablo yeah <laughs> Triple skull. Okay. Well, yeah, we got the cool broom now too, so we can like clean skull things. on skull and make them kiss. Skull <laughs> fill to do anything. Oh. Okay, let's uh. Do, do. Ooh, how about that great thing or that whatever that hatch? Does that open the hatch? Nope. No. Can't open the hatch. It's magically sealed. Hot skull on skull action. Okay, so. Let's see. We've got the dragon cave that we can go to. Uh, we've got the funny fire zone that we can go to. We've got the wraith. The wraith is bad. They're boning. They're boning. Speak the spell words on that seal. Oh yeah, let's go back to the waterfall and see if we can... Yeah, that's a good idea. ...do magic at that seal. Yeah. This is very much uh, adventure game style. What the fuck does this do? <laughs> we got a new thing, let's rub it on everything else until something moves. Some spectral person at the edge of your consciousness. I like that. 
Concentrate, drawing power from the air itself. The moment beast spell the word, the exception of annoying headache, nothing else resulted from your favorite spell casting. Okay. From your spell casting. Oh, I don't know why favorite came to mind there. <laughs> That's my favorite spell casting. As your bills an uncomfortable level, you release the spell. <sighs> oh, the magically sealed thing in the. Oh. Oh, the hatch. I think, oh. I think you tried to agape the hatch. Maybe. Which we do kind of want the hatch to be agape, so that would make sense. <laughs> but. Just, oh, oh! Oh! We didn't do that. I thought we, we did. We sure that. did not do that. There we go. Thanks, Julie. We're <laughs> gonna be wandering around otherwise. Oh! Lean in close, anxious to look inside the hatch. Oh. Okay, so that presumably does something to the waterfall. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is new. This is definitely not in the original. Harp harbors a strange mechanism, one comprised of levers, rods, and gears. Neat. This gear appears loosely connected to the rest of the mechanism. Okay, we're gonna line all these gears up. We're down with a satisfied grunt. Oh, it sure did mention three levers. Or at least three of something. Three towers, I think. Okay. Single tall spire in the center. Which could well mean one lever. Uh. Okay. Single line points to the exact middle of the tower, next to it these words. Three times right, then once pulled down. Twice past midnight points to the ruined crown. Light becomes dark, the king sits the throne, the masked one revealed shall mark the stone. Huh. It sure doesn't seem... Ooh, we... ...actionable to this, but... Oh, okay, right, so we push button. Okay. Approaching the ancient mechanism turns while the gears stop. Listen for any telltale sounds something might have happened. Nothing. Okay. Can we, like... Might want to try again. Yeah, thanks, bud! Can we, like, move the gears around? Do something with them. Take the gear. Loose gear, but do not have the leverage to pry it away. Okay, so I disagree. Succeeds in dulling the weapon. Okay, well let's use a longer thing then, I guess. <laughs> okay, nope. Spear. Longest <laughs> thing we have. Yeah. Gear is just too unwieldy to effectively work on the gear. I agree, video game. That's actually fair. No way to take the gear. Okay, so taking the gear is probably not it. Okay, so let's let's pull the lever and see what happens when we push the button. Oh, there's maximum levels of. Did that turn more gears that time? I don't think it did. Deafening mm. silence. Okay. You can't eat that. Can't eat that. that one gear looks like its conscience is bothering it. <laughs> Which mm. one? Guilty gear, God.
Oh. Spreading green power. Yeah. The the wraith did something to us. Yeah, I know, Yorick. Yeah, we know, dude. We try it all down in one in the center. Okay, that makes it. Mm. Can we brute force if, this, like... What if just the right one all the way down? Because that's the one that's, I guess, has the mark on it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I guess not. Okay, so how effectively can we brute force this? Uh, three. It's a bunch. Use the sling on the gears? Yeah, okay. Wild, well, but okay. On the gears, yeah, okay. Sling on the gear, it feels accomplish much of anything. That's a shame. We can super brute force this 64, but I really don't want to subject chat to that. I guess we could just uh -huh. try, just as a a baseline, let's just uh, do them in every identical state. Yeah, okay. Guess of steam coming from then nothing. Is that better? Okay. Did that do something? I need to remember to use the keyboard shortcuts in order to be here all day. And, uh... Yeah, bud, I know it didn't sound right. <laughs> the one gear looks magnetic and very stable. What does Yorick have to say on this matter, anyway? Anything at all, or is he like, maybe if you just change the levers? Better be sure you want my advice before you speak to me again, because I'll be giving the hints next. Okay. Wizards use many mechanisms like this, the levers are pulled correctly, but only. Well, well great. Great. <laughs> the, the great hint, you stupid idiot. The metal gear, solid. <laughs> That's fucking it! Jesus. It's just his hint! That's my hint, isn't it great? <laughs> if you solve the puzzle, something good will happen. Aren't you glad you brought your good pal your work along with you? Whoa! Okay. This <laughs> does that the sometimes. The nausea huh? squashes over you. You reel from the discomfort before your eyes. Aches and chills rack your body. If you feel as bad as you look, then you're in deep trouble. Grimacing, you heft the iron shield higher, gaining a little comfort. That's right. So we're definitely on a, a timer <laughs> we're here. Just like, yeah, we're just like slow poison from this thing. Yeah. Ah, oh, jeez. I hope we get to. I hope we have a way of curing that. Hmm. Okay, I have no goddamn idea. It feels like we're missing something there. Yeah, we are. I guess we do have another spell that we can yeah. do on other stuff. The correct code is likely behind the waterfall. Oh my god, Julie, you're a genius. Okay. Um, 
I made him halfway attempt to... Well, let's just keep going and see how fucked we are. <laughs> I feel like we tried to grab just about every gear. There again, like we didn't try with the um, the arrow to pry it out. So true. Not a video game pun. I, I was halfway expecting one, to be honest. <laughs> the air becomes heavy oh. and the very shadows seem to I merge. See you have run afoul of my traps. Still, you have managed oh. to overcome them and make it this far. I shall concede that you are proving most resourceful. You will soon discover your efforts are but in vain. In an instant, the dread apparition dissipates. Give me a cold chill in its wake. <sighs> Neat! Okay, I think he's just there to taunt us a little bit. Blah. Attempt to traverse the pounding waters that fall from the waterfall. The sheer power of it pushes you back. Okay. Ooh, is that another sigil there? Uh, underground. Oh, that's not it. Ooh. There is something above that that kind of looks like it could be the answer. Uh, above this? Above the symbol, there's like a gash in the rock, and then there's oh, like a. Oh, yeah, kind of like an upside down thing or something. Yeah. Um, I guess we've not tried this one on this guy. Concentration is thoroughly compromised by the watery being, so you miscast your spell and create a small explosion. Water elemental responds with a squirt of water in the eye. You know what? Fair. That's very fair. How do we turn off the waterfall? Because it sure looks like the uh, lever would control the waterfall and allow us to get behind the waterfall. Yeah, that's what I was assuming I was doing. Okay, you can't just talk to the big giant head. King doesn't speak to us either. Ugh. Okay, yeah, oh. I don't see anything that looks that looks like an answer to that puzzle. Hmm. I guess we could try one of those spells on the Wraith. Okay, yeah. Try one of bomb boy. Oh, yeah, sure. game you needed a special striped torch for the wraith. Oh. Alright. I remember something something with this bone boy. We My are on difficulty Yeah. Because, uh... <laughs> we we kinda just figured, you know what, why not? Why not? I played this game about sixteen years ago. I remember how to do everything. 
They definitely never changed anything. You seem to both cast the spell and throw it across the surface of the lake. Okay. This fails miserably in a misfire that explodes painfully in your face. Neat. Stab him with the spear. I remember something with that little dude. He's definitely there for a reason. But maybe it's not a reason we can reasonably resume. Hmm. Okay, so... Okay. It's a bit too far away for spears. Yeah. Can we just hurl the arrow? <laughs> nope, we're not going to risk wading into the waters. Oh my god, can you use the skulls with the sling? Can you sling skulls? Sadly, no. Oh. Okay, fine. Hey, squeak! Fit. Hello! Uh, the... Coins out of the sockets. Definitely coins. Definitely uh, those coins. Are glasses. Yeah, it's yeah. A pair of glasses and they're kind of melted to the skull. <gasps> Let's go mess with the wraith for a bit. What if we? Oh yeah, we invoke this bone boy. Bounces uselessly against the cold dead stone. Okay, what about this bone boy? There's stone from the shore by the Womber. Uh, I don't think so, but it's worth a look. These stones that aren't part of the traditional JPEG. Uh oh, I've gone to hell again. Oh no. <laughs> Here I am. I'm in hell. Sense something large and ominous deep beneath the surface of these black waters. There technically are rocks around, but they don't look the cupable. Maybe if we just use the sling. It'll just go, yeah, okay, you can get a rock. Oh, yeah. Oh, nope. Okay. Fine. Fine. Okay, uh... I guess let's go cast a spell on a wraith. <laughs> Fuck you, orc. Goblin, whatever you are. Buddy. Gorkblin. Okay. Oh, oh no, we need a, a special striped torch. That's right. Cold and dark. Okay, bud. Light is no, always the greatest need... weapon against creatures of the dark. Yeah, cold and dark was enough of a hint that we need fire. Okay. Can we kick that stupid major over. Oh, we have already used a torch on him and it went poorly. Yeah, he's just like, actually you're dead now, and then we're just like, oh, dang, we're dead now. Did, did you interact with that little... that rock off to the right side? Because it's on our map, so it's important for some reason. Yeah, oh, yeah. One. Ringless keystone is of a circle within a shield outline. Strange writings cover the stone, and you think you recognize the name Majal among the hard to decipher oh, language. Yeah, okay. Oh, the lever puzzle has an audio component. Oh. Okay. Didn't didn't hear that. Oh no, you knew your bruckles. I sure did. It is your brockles. Okay. Click, 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 click. 
That didn't sound right. <laughs> oh, now it went again. I fix. Oh, thank you. There's a little scraping sound there. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, chat. Uh, I'm gonna. Now, this is stupid, but is the symbol the answer? Is it supposed to be like because of the way the lines are pointing and the symbol up, down, and then middle? Surely not, but... Oh, like... You see what I'm saying? Because there's like the three lines in that symbol. The one on the left is kind of facing up, the one in the middle is facing down. Yeah. I hate... Fucking Christ! God I damn it! Life. I hate my life. <laughs> I hate my life. I'm a power that accompanies the turning of the gears. You hear the faraway rattle of chains followed by the rumble of rumbling rumble. Whopper. That sounded far away, didn't it? I wonder what just happened, Yorick adds in a whisper. I can't believe that was actually... I, I was... I didn't think I could reach that far deep into my ass to pull something like that out, <laughs> but damn. Apparently you've got hidden depths. Oh, I've got hidden depths. <laughs> oh, okay, well... Oh. But it wasn't for this. Okay, so the only other places that had something that seemed to be locked was uh, in the crypt, I think. Yeah, the mirror room. Yeah, so I guess we gotta go and pry that skull back out again. Okay, so not here then. Okay. Okay, in here. There's only the dragon past there. There's not many places that that could have done anything in. Maybe it did something we can't get to yet. That would is suck. There... <laughs> that would suck. Is there is there more we can do with those? God, I hope not. Because it, it it sure didn't have anything to do with the waterfall, <laughs> as it turned out. So maybe I just got lucky. Okay, nothing seems to have changed here. Yeah. And this is the same too. Like, unless we missed something with the waterfall, maybe it was gentler? <laughs> we solved half of the waterfall turning off puzzle. Uh, yeah, when Mela mentioned it, I ungarbled the sleep cam. Well, I'm gonna guess 
It's not gently considering it's too powerful to walk. Can we drink some more water? <laughs> um, yeah, let's just... Can we drink the water full dry? There we go. That's better. <sighs> Dungeon water. There are some, like, cool glyphs above that guy's head. Yeah, I know there's something that we have to do with him. I guess <sighs> I didn't use the <laughs> other spell. Oh, hydrate. Where's my water? Well, this is Mountain Dwarf, but it's Bajar Blast, so it's kind of water. Oh. There we go. I guess I didn't try the other spell on this guy. Whoops! Uh, uh oh. Okay, so I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> but do it, you didn't, you done did do. Okay, how far back's our last save? Golly. Hard to say. Okay, like a few minutes ago, so it's not too bad. Fair, I don't think we made an enormous amount of progress. No. Okay. I didn't even mean to go into the water, I was just... I just didn't realize I had the water selected for use. Okay, I haven't tried this one on the Skellington. And... It didn't work. Okay, for the sake of sanity, I've learned that there are multiple things you can do with the gears. Oh! I didn't look into what they are, I just know that that is a thing. Okay... Uh, we don't seem to have a Dennis option as the problem. I think this game's kind of broken. Yeah, we're, we're without Dennis. <sighs> okay, so... It was... Up, down, middle. What if we... Yeah. Reverse that and do... Middle... Up. Down? Is that reverse? Eh, good enough. No. Frustratedly, push the button several times but will not depress. Perhaps the mechanism is not properly uh, powered. I don't think we have the skull on the thing anymore. Oh, right. Nightbot, Nightbot, can you help us? <laughs> Nightbot, can you give us a tip? <laughs> Ooh, you hear the rush okay. of water somewhere nearby. Okay, that's good. So it seems like... Okay, so it would seem that the one lever has to be... Lever. One lever has to be up, one has to be down, and one has to be middle. I rub it off on you. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh oh. That's probably oh, yeah. not good. Racked by a coughing fit, the iron taste of blood filling your mouth. It begins to spin as you're haunted by the specter of the Banshee and its curse. Your cursed body is getting worse by the second. You don't know how long you can continue this journey. The dead weight of the iron shield strapped to your arm only seems to make things worse. Oh cool. boy. Cool, cool, cool. You should regain your equilibrium as the nausea withdrawals and your senses return. You realize beyond a shadow of a doubt, Banshee's curse is killing you. You must find a cure. You must find a cure. Well, hopefully it's behind the waterfall. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. So. So it lied to us. Where else could water have happened? Uh, I guess either the ice room or the lava lake place? Yeah.
Oh, it's me again. No. <laughs> okay, not here either. It's okay. nearby, but not like. Hopefully and, nearby. Yeah, no flooded stairs unless it's like out front. Nope. Okay, so let's test this theory. So we had like um We had up down middle and then down middle up, I think, or something. So let's see what this one does. Oh, okay. So maybe our theory is incorrect. Okay, maybe the... The middle one can't be directly... It can't be... The, Maybe the middle setting can't be in the middle? That makes sense. Hmm. I think there must just be a certain number of combinations. Mm -hmm. Rush of water somewhere nearby, again. Okay. <laughs> Just fucking flush the necromancer's toilet or something. <laughs> Stop doing that! You're wasting my water! <laughs> you know what it costs to plumb a whole mountain? Okay, hang on. Uh, I'm just gonna... Uh, get my actual ass notebook here. And a pet. <laughs> Wait. Where's a pen? Why don't I have a pen in my goddamn desk? <laughs> you know what? Uh, actually, yeah, natural 20, a hint would go down real smooth right now. Huh. I can't find my goddamn pen. I know that there's one around here, but... Yeah. Oh no. I think that we need to go into the cellar off the small hall. The cellar. Cellar. Oh. Oh, like beyond here? Uh, beyond the cool crackly zone? Thus far, this game has proven less deadly than I was expecting. I do remember dying a lot more, but it also didn't have, like, gear puzzles. No plate blocks the way down. Secured from below. You tried to smash the other door the windows, or whatever those are, right? <laughs> I'm pretty sure, yeah. I guess it doesn't hurt to smash him some more. Yeah, no. Hmm. 
Unless some shit's happened in the dragon room. Maybe we flushed away the dragon? <laughs> nope. Bet we haven't. No. Oh, no goddamn idea what any of these spells <laughs> do. Dumb spider. Okay. I can obtain a hint for the sake of this not being the rest of the stream. Please. Does that sound good? Uh, yeah. Uh, let me uh, let me feed you if some you'd play. Like that hint. Oh yeah, <laughs> give me some play coins. <laughs> uh, you tried using the torch on the elemental. Ooh, no, actually, we hang did. on a sec. I think we yeah. did, and it just kind of bounced around. Okay, one sec while I just, uh, just get you a little funny little, uh... Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. What's happening? It's okay, don't worry about it. The, the sounds are... sounds are fine. Okay. Love websites that just tell you right most button first, left most button first. Oh, oh what? Give me one of my faces. Okay. There's supposed to be a pry bar. Oh. Hmm. What, what have you done? What are you doing? What happened? What's happening? It, it is okay. I'm just. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Okay. Ah, okay. Ah. Uh... Uh, hang on a sec, I gotta move this down a little bit. Okay, make, make, make crunching noises. There we go. Alright, if you like the hint, you can DM me. Oh, okay. Well, that's gonna turn the music off again. <laughs> oh, don't! I already gave you the hint. Oh, smiley face. I can DM you. I can dungeon master you. Uh 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 uh. Can't DM you. You can DM me. DM sleet. No. D DM me. DM me. DM me. DM me. Dungeon Mistress? I am the Dungeon Mistress, that's true, but irrelevant at this juncture. Dangerously misuse you? Nope. The. M. M. Me. D. M. 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 She's calling me a dummy! No! No! That's not what's happening! D me. D M me. D M. What I have learned is that in the, the, the journeyman difficulty in this game, apparently you can pry out one of the gears to get one of two solutions. And in the master difficulty, there's three solutions and there are no gears, so you just have to kind of brute force it. Oh. Which is really cool. So. Oh, I see! Oh, you got it! <laughs> <laughs> oh. The apparition... This really can't be good. You must find a cure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will find a dang cure. Find a cure soon. Your adventures will end here. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, town. Middle. Engage. 
Down, middle, middle? Oh. See, I, you solved a puzzle, just not this bad puzzle. <laughs> you solved my bad puzzle. Dang, okay. Well, <laughs> congratulations, Elizabeth. That's a bad, <laughs> strong bad voice. <laughs> Hello, everyone. It is me, Strong Bad. Oh, finally! Fucking <laughs> finally! So, the puzzle was to just do down, middle, middle. Uh -huh. And you don't get to learn that anywhere. You just have to do it. Fuck me. And here's me just going, <laughs> it can't possibly be brute forcing it. That we would be here all goddamn night. I know, it's so bad. Okay. I need a trickle of water. Shadowgate is a great game, and that was not part of Shadowgate. They thought they could add their own puzzles. Oh, wrong, says a natural 20. Apparently, it is referenced somewhere? Oh, maybe. The, the secret that I saw. Oh, that's not- oh, that is C Senor Cargage, you're super right. Hey bud, were you reaching for those stones? Oh, just let me eat these. Interesting, some sort of regal set of robes, blood stains the collar. Perhaps provide a clue to what killed this unfortunate soul. Neat! Ooh. I hope he died from drinking, drinking too much Wraith Curse Cure. I know, right? This looks like a spell. Symbols etched on the wall look some- uh, the steps magi are a traveling troop of performers and fortune tellers. So one of uh, the youth at Stormhaven. Why is it initial caps? That's weird. Okay. <laughs> it's firmly attached to the wall. This room glows with power. It's firmly attached to the wall. That skull's got another thingy on it. Ooh, yeah. Let's, uh... Yoink. Thank you. Uh, Powerful. Ooh. Struggle to pull the rune from the wall. Okay, so hit it then. Okay. Mr. Brockles. Pry it off the wall? I really aren't that hungry. <laughs> Okay, nope. Cannibalism. Yeah, I was gonna use eat on skeleton. No, oh, okay, that's fair. Okay. Uh, well, okay, so this... Whatever, assuming it's just a simple letter cipher, then... I've got the f same letter in the first position here, and then uh, the same letter in this position here, and the rest of it is incomprehensible. Have a nice day. <laughs> I'm gonna go skip stones at that skeleton. Yeah. Just plug, plug this other head in. Oh yeah, you got rocks. Oh. Well, you fumble okay. off of the cradle of the string. As if to mock you, the banshee appears again in your fevered imaginings. Stagger about for a moment before you master the pain. This is becoming critical. If you don't find an antidote soon, you'll be history. I know, video game! No! <laughs> Stop shaming us! Okay, well. <laughs> Obviously, to use the sling on the skeleton, you've got to wade into the water, so. to fuck you, I guess. <laughs> Okay. Well, goodness knows what this is gonna do. Oh yeah, I guess we could use the sling on the the orc. Oh! Oh, hey, Spoony! Oh, it's right to see you raiding with a party oh, of nine. Holy shit! Hey, everybody. Oh my gosh! Oh, it's right to see you all. 
Oh, Milk Succubus. That's a good fucking name. Oh. <laughs> We're deep in the deep, dark depths of Shadowgate. Yeah. It's scary. It's so yeah, scary. Yeah. Oh, well, folks, uh, I'm just going to give a real quick shout out here. Uh, there we go. Oh, Resident Evil Village. Hell yeah. Uh, Spoonie is rad. Uh, they are good artists. We've we played their game um, Mixed Feelings uh, during Girl Stream Team vs. Transphobia, and it was very cool. And I yeah. do want to go back to that sometime, because we super left it off on a cliffhanger. Mm -hmm. Oh, you, you can word ban, Carmela. It just costs a hundred thousand beans now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, uh, welcome, folks from Spoonie's stream. Uh, we are Girl Stream Team. We are variety streamers, and right now we're doing a bunch of horror games because you know it's Halloween. Ah, oh, thank you, Birds Night. Yeah, uh, we uh, oh. these are done by um, uh, not not too night over on Twitter. Um, I I I uh, I really like them a lot. Uh, yeah. We originally got them just for our Deltarune stream, uh, but you know. Uh, we don't have other VTubers, so like, this this <laughs> is they're, good. they're really good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is Shadowgate, which is uh, a remaster. Oh, hmm. pause while doing chat stuff so the Banshee timer doesn't increment. Oh, beans! I didn't. Oh, I didn't realize it was like real time oh. timer. I thought it was like on move. Oh, beans. Okay. Yeah, I think I think remaster is a bit of a generous. Yeah. Um, a re-release to some extent. This is a very old game that was maybe on DOS or MSX or something. Or... Yeah, yeah. I played it as a child a lot on my Game Boy, um, and it was really good. It scared me a lot. Okay, so but nothing's changed. Surprisingly different. Mm -hmm. We had to get behind the waterfall so we could get some special rocks, so that we can maybe throw them at someone. Did you throw it at the the skull on that pillar? Ooh, I haven't Did tried that die? yet. Okay, let's see. Use this on Strumbo. No real idea what you're doing. You swing your weapon around in the air. Unbeknownst to you, the rock releases, striking the wall behind you. Did I just waste a cool rock? Oh, I sure did. Sure did. That sucks. <laughs> I need that probably. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Um. Well, we're. I would like to say that we're one step forward and that we did find... We did make progress, technically. Yeah. Still God knows what we're actually doing. Yeah, if uh, any folks from uh, Spoonie's chat uh, want to, you know, uh, check us out longer term and uh, hit that follow button, we'd love to have you... Uh, Join the community. It's uh, mm -hmm. rad having you folks here. Uh, I wish I knew what this thing does. Any of our spells? Yeah. 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 Licking your finger, you touch the bowl in the brazier to test its temperature. You receive a nasty burn for your troubles. Oh, you need to use a spell or a potion on yourself for that rope bridge to be light enough to cross it. I I do remember that. Yeah, I think we've there's a spell we can get that makes us lighter, mm. but I don't think it's one of the ones we have. I guess I haven't rubbed all my things on all the other things. It's true. Over here, I, I'm gonna reload because I did use up one of my precious cool rocks that we can only get That's in that fair. one location. <laughs> in this cave full of rocks.
Okay, so we've got... Yeah, okay. We've got our cool rock back. Okay, uh... Rub this spell on that. Da -da -da, expecting something wonderful to happen. Nothing does. Use this Nothing spell. Look. Uh, nothing happens. Ooh, it, it glow. <gasps> oh. 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 Oh, it glow because I highlighted. Oh, you're just highlighting it. <laughs> well, neat. This room glows with power. It is firmly attached to the wall. Can we open it? Can we hit it with a hammer? That'd be cool. No effect on the room. And we can't pry it off the wall. Man. There's a little bird in my ear saying that we might... Okay, well, I've got another hint for you. Uh huh. I don't remember that that's how that do, but if we want to make some progress, we gotta go back to a different dead guy. Okay. Uh, we cannot take the glasses off the skull. We have tried to smash the skull, we've tried yeah. to open the skull, we've tried a bunch of different skull things. They are. They have been fused to the skull with the dragon's breath. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, use candle on torch? Oh. Now I know that... Well. Uh, use torch on candle? Use an unlit torch on candle, maybe? Oh. You know that when we used... When we tried to take the candles, we wicked died. It's in our last torch. Candles flame spreads hungrily to the torch, burning an intense green color. You swapped out for the other one, yeah, and dropping the other torch behind you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's our last torch, so uh Neat. this better work. <laughs> it better had to. Quang. I like the thought that you, you've got this tiny, like, matchstick torch that you're holding with your left arm, like, over your right shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> you're just protecting with your shield just now. <laughs> yeah. uh, okay. Use cool torch on Spectre. Cry, you swing the enchanted torch to the right. The ethereal beings are instantly enveloped in a bright flash of flames, its tortured moan resonating in your head. Ba da da ba ba ba, that's <laughs> progress! Oh, is that it? Just dead on the floor? <laughs> oh, you put the cloak in your satchel. Hell yeah. Cool. The fabric of this cloak has a wispy, almost ethereal feel to it. Put it on. I mean, I guess we could have figured that one out because we knew we needed a special torch and that was the only other, like... Yeah. <laughs> it was special fire, but, but damn. Okay, so here's the Triforce. Okay. Rune is firmly attached to the wall, glowing with power. Definitely wicked can't pry those off the wall. Absolutely, definitely not. I've tried a bunch of... I mean, let's just... Stupid. Yeah, no. Okay, fine. Blessed. Oh, the unintentional pun. Wicked died. Wicked <laughs> died. Oh, oh hey, uh... You made chest high into the sewer water, just wondering just how you got roped into this adventure. Oh, there's another... there's another one. Oh, hey! One of those symbols. Look at... you cannot go there. I... oh, well, no, I would like to take that. Ooh! You take the empty bottle. Oh, beans. Oh. <laughs> I hoped it was full of anti curse juice. Yeah. yeah, me too! Yeah, we know! Wretch uncontrollably. You're definitely in trouble, adventurers. <laughs> they stole the end of your adventures. Yeah, I know, dude. Now we have to go 
go back to the other levers. Go back in different levers. But yeah, there are other options where either uh, it's either middle up down or up down middle. Yeah. Oh, hey, those are fancy now with the power on. Oh, they kind of are. Yeah, look, two of them are good. Oh, I'm reminded of King Otto's fair. Mm -hmm. Strangly. Strangly the mirror. Strangly. <laughs> hey, everybody. It's me, Strangly the mirror. Okay, well, I guess we can put water in this one. It's true. Oh, words on the right wall. Okay. Uh... Is that where we learn Epor, Julie? In trays. Mud and UDM were the same. Oh, yeah. yeah. There's Epor. Epor oh. is the best magical spell in any game. It's strangely familiar is the word. That's just E, P, P and R. Oh, and carve them to the wall. Uh. <laughs> Use? That seems a rather odd thing to do. Uh oh. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Okay, well, on the plus side, a lot of what we've done was knowledge gated. So, do we just go from the start and. I think so. We can it? knock this out real quick. Okay. Classic. We we do. I'm gonna bust this out now. We have to get through those um, coffins, so we have to get cursed. Oh yeah, absolutely, we do. The hero's journey. The hero's journey. Oh yeah, we were out of torches also. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Dirk e on the on the roots or vines or whatever those are. Cannot go there. Oh, yeah, but I just wanted to get it. Do I have to get you, bud? Sadly. Okay. Oh, God. Take me before you go any further. Okay. Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Use fist on Yorick. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> okay, use bread key. Use hat on self. <laughs> use key. Ah. Uh Everybody who's just joined, watch, pretend the last few minutes didn't happen, and look at how good we are at video games. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm the big bad warlock. Black I'm Viewer is a fool to- Hey, stop skipping through my text. <laughs> ah, I've trapped you here. You can't skip that. <laughs> yeah, we got ghost murdered in sewer water. It's awesome. Just wanted you to know how much of a bitch like me is. Mm -hmm. So anyway. I'm pretty sure, again, in the Game Boy Color game, he shows up and he's just like, fuck you, and then he goes away. And there's really <laughs> not... There's really very little. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, torches, torches, torches. I got burned the fucking rug, get the money. I'm so good at this. You're extremely like, oh, good I, at video I bet games. you can eat that lever with your butt, or what was the joke? <laughs> Probably something like that. Do we have to do all the jokes real quick again, too? Oh, jeez, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we can <laughs> put the lever up. I guess, uh, somewhere. Mm -hmm. uh, so you can we... eat it backwards, that's what it was. Eat it backwards, that was it. Yeah. Okay, so open we... Open and read the book. Take this, open, uh, look at book. Cool mm -hmm. book, mm -hmm. love the book. Mm -hmm. Invocan. Great. Uh, hit this, uh, uh whoops. Piss click, on the dead guy. Click out of the thing. Uh, Man, we're so good at video games. A boar... I'm a born lever pooler. <laughs> dude, look! Ah, you are oh, unable dude, to go wow. to the skeleton. Ah, oh, that's so sad. Boy, you better York. pay attention to. I'm not a boy, York, you bitch. I'm 17! <laughs> <laughs> open, open, open! Uh, let's wow. see, did we need to go this way first? Probably not. I don't think there's much to do here right now. I think we can go left first. Oh, yeah. 
Also our torch. Oh, yep, bad torch music. Scary torch music. Oh good, I, I almost forgot to make sure you got all of the skeletons and bones and heads. <laughs> oh, lucky. Torch on thing, torch on other thing. Get that thing. Nope. I keep trying He's to get it instead of take it. <laughs> He's gone on man. Okay. <laughs> He's gone on man. I mean, that's my favorite puzzle in any video game ever. <laughs> Absolutely. Open, open. Ah, oh, lore. Okay, cool puzzles. Okay, cool. Okay. Uh, I'll go get... Uh, oh, yep, we didn't grab the torches. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, we need... Uh, oh, yeah, actually, we... Yeah, we don't. We can just go there now. Use shield on Dagron. Use shield on self. Dagron makes TIE Fighter noise. Glasses, hammer, spear. Oh, we're so good at Shadowgate, y'all. Mm hmm. Shield's doing bad. Okay. Later, dragon. Double deuces to the dragon as we run. <laughs> Absolutely. Double deuces. Spiders. Yeah, fucking Doctor Nerd Skull there. Um. Okay. He's way better than Yorick. Okay. We just not need to get the wooden shield at this point. I guess kind of not, huh? I oh, can't even boy. where wooden oh, shield was. It's in one of the coffins, I think. Oh yeah. Oh, I guess we do need to get wooden shield from here because if we're here, so that we can. Oh, to get the arrow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I love also how not all of the skulls of the same shape stack. <laughs> yeah. That was a really fun, fun little part of our inventory. He's just watching us do this too. Look at him up there. <laughs> just like. Oh, Let's maybe do. they're a goblin too. They're now, should we do the the wraith now? Yeah, might as well get that done. Do as much as we can without this stupid curse. Yeah. Twang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twang my longbow, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Boo, I'm a big scary ghost or whatever. I hope you don't set me on fire with magic fire. My one weakness. I know, Boo. That's his one weakness. Use fire on Wraith. There we go. Enchanted torch. Yep, yep, yep. Get cool cloak. It is impossible to do that. <laughs> no, I want to take the cool cloak. I'm gonna Lying. keep fucking trying to get things instead of take things, which is a shame. You cannot go cloak, you go road. Now what's down here? Oh, it's still wet. Okay. Still wet. Epor. What is Epor? It's Epor. It's the best spell in the world. Uh huh? Epor. I don't get it. It's just really good. <laughs> what? Julie knows. Julie knows. It's literally the best. What? Epor is a great spell, don't worry about it. Okay. <laughs> oh, blocked by a rock. Okay. Oh yeah, we have to kind of Dwayne that Johnson out of the way. Okay, open this. Oh, there's another book, there's another book. I need to read, there's another scroll, there's another scroll. Okay, and there's the oh, agate. Trays. Oh no, oh. A tray. Yeah. My little fella, what's up? You want to help do some puzzles and mysteries? Come here, do some fantasy mysteries with us, kitty. There he is. Okay, Hello. so... I guess we can use one of these spells on us. Sure. Visualize the glyph in your mind and release the power. The spell right back at yourself. Dazzling lights, the spell momentarily blinds you. You pick through your cover. You should probably save before you cast any more mystery spells on yourself. It's <laughs> a good point, actually. <laughs> You're gonna turn into a pile of mystery skulls if you do that. <laughs> Catch my cold. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, jeez. What shall happen when I try to use I a spell I don't know? I don't know if you know. want to cast a gape on yourself. <laughs> this is, we've got, we've got rules in chat. <laughs> Sparks and white swirls of magic. Dance about your boots for a brief instant. Is that oh. good? Okay, yeah, run across that bridge. <laughs> nope! That wasn't good. <laughs> Incorrect! Wrong! I thought that was... <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, maybe that was the fun levitation spell. I was, yeah, I, was, I was like, okay, maybe, maybe we're light. <laughs> Like, I feel like also the game better. might tell us. Yeah, well, I mean, it is. affected our boots, so I just kind of assumed. Mm -hmm. I guess it okay. just gave us cool boots. The spell of neat boots. Spell of kinky boots. The spell of foot bridges. <laughs> oh. Sparkle footing as you tumble into the void. Very good. <laughs> There's not a lot of bridges that aren't foot bridges, if you think about it. Especially not in, like, fantasy times. I mean, I guess not. Like, there's cart bridges. a little tautological. Yeah, but... Like, uh, horses have feet. I was gonna say hooves have feet. Okay, da 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 Magic dance still around here, giving you nonsense. Okay, so none of these work on us. Okay. What if we use them on the keystone? <laughs> Cast the spell, and now your pancreas is backwards. <laughs> Enjoy! Oh, We've what's got a, some weird wizards in our neck of the woods. What's a backwards pancreas do for you? Does uh, it require you to eat a bunch of sugar so that... <laughs> it's just physically backwards. I don't think that would do anything. Oh, okay. So it's it, not... It's all the same. It's just it produces... Nilusne. Okay, so the the function of it is not reversed. <laughs> you no, it's on the physically black backwards in your body. In your body. <laughs> okay. Okay, so... Okay, time for a fun curse, I guess. Come to think of it, none of the... I don't think much of the shit from here did much for us. Well, one of these has the the magic skull that we need, right? Oh, true, yeah. Okay, well... And also, like, the scepter and... The hammer, yeah. Okay, so... Cool Banshee always appears from... One of them, doesn't yeah. matter which one you open. Pretty much. Okay, now desecrate grave. One, <laughs> two, three. Oh, yeah, and that shield. Burninate. Burninating the corpses. Definitely, we'll get the definitely not enlarged and mirrored dark. <laughs> yeah, That's right. It's a definitely different sword. They're like, oh shit, we gotta make it at least a little different. Oh, put a little white bit on it instead of a red bit, I guess. <laughs> They'll never know! Okay, scroll okay, in that one. Scroll, that one's about the Taj Mahal or whatever, I That think. one had some cool dice in it. Okay. Alright. Hmm. Danger is real or whatever. I guess switch our shields out? Yeah, might so as well. we can get the arrow later. Yeah. Okay, I think we're good to go. Boninating the peasants. Boninating <laughs> all the people in their thatch roof cottages! Thank, thank you, I don't think I could have done that. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, twang. Alright. <laughs> Take the very large arrow. The goblork has, <laughs> has twanged us with an arrow. I'm gonna put the big shield back on. I don't know. My memory tells me we only need the big shield for the dragon. Mm -hmm. Use this. Take that. Yeah. Okay. Take the broom, yeah. take the torch, um, take the torch, torch, take the torch. torch. Get a bunch of bad luck. Just, yeah, just go to the fucking town. Bang, bang. Maxwell hates fun houses. <laughs> or however that song goes. No, that's definitely how it goes. Yeah. And that Trotter comes in the night! Oh, Okay. 
Yeah, Boof. I think Boof's trying to hit that high note as well. Okay, He's doing so... doing a great job. He wants the... me to go turn his hot pad on. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, okay. So the one spell that we've actually been able to use constructively on anything is a gape. That opens the hatch. Okay, items. Use Cool Skull in this one. Go this way. So I want to fill the actual factual good flask with water. Oh uh, yeah, but we still have water to fill it with. It's a good idea. Yeah. It's got to be fresh water, not bad sewer water. Must mm, be stinky. fresh. <laughs> Must be human. Must be. Must be human. Human water. Water. Okay. Don't know what we're gonna do with that. Okay, so I guess we can dra drain one of those things. I feel like there's no reason not to just go ahead and drain everything. I mean, do we choose between which one to drain? Oh, pour I, the I water on the fire near the bridges. That's a good point. Let's try yeah, it. Yeah, I was wondering about that. I was going to say quick save and, and pour it on that, that big brazier or whatever and see what happens. Mm -hmm. Don't worry if my voice sounds small. I just got shrunk by a magic spell. She's tiny, 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 and she's super into it. Just, oh, man. <laughs> it's really cool. I'm going to... Wear a button like a shield, and I'm gonna have a, a cute little letter, letter opener as my big sword. Okay, so what if what if okay, water on? Okay, do I have? Because it seemed mostly like just a middle fingler, fingler to the goblork. Yeah, a little bit. Talking is difficult. Talking is difficult, I agree. She could be... I'm... No, let's just go to the waterfall. We know that works. <laughs> we know the waterfall doesn't have a kraken in it. Yeah. Attack, use bottle on fire. Okay, uh, take wood. There's no way to take the campfire. I disagree! There's no way. Okay. Well, I, I guess there's one more fire to do, so let's go do that. It's true. a quick travel by the way oh if it does i'm gonna be very happy let's see what is this button okay that's where am i currently so no i don't think that it oh. acts as any kind of quick travel which is a shame yeah, been cool. one good thing they could have added to this game yeah. <laughs> like, no Gear puzzles! <laughs> Guzzles! Guzzles! Guzzles your puzzles. Okay. I don't know what good this is gonna do for us, but... In the bottle and the brazier, the fire briefly sizzles, but not do does not go out. You need more water. Okay. <laughs> Guzzling glizzies. Ah. Oh. I hear that Biden's the throat goat. Jesus, what? <laughs> Biden's really good at guzzling blizzies. He's a throat goat. <laughs> are you are you good? Did, did... good for him? <laughs> I don't know. It was something that some Twitter posted. Did, did, Trumpist to annoy them. Oh. Just... 
Can you bottle the water elemental? That seems cool, but maybe. That is a thought. That is a thought. She said pointing to me. <laughs> Are you good? Did you just get stabbed by a boot? <laughs> no, I was just so upset that you called me a thought that one time. I tried to use the bottle and the elemental at effortless to then search your reach. Okay, but it's full, so what if we... Okay, you guzzle down the water. Yum. Use water on... Nope. Ah. Okay. It was worth a shot. Never know when you might need a bottled water elemental. It's true. And I will leave it as an uh, exercise for the chat to decide... <laughs> Uh, where the emphasis on that one is. Crams a water elemental into my camel bag. <laughs> <laughs> or is this an elemental of bottled water? So it was... M-U-D-U-D-M-D-M-M. -M -M. Okay. M middle up, down. Middle up, down, middle up, down. Middle up, down, middle up, down. DMM. Yeah. DMM. Okay, that's one. Stupid puzzle. Mud. And what was the other one? Uh, up, down, middle. Up, down, middle. Unparalleled dungeon mistress. There we go. I thought that in my head and never said it, but I remembered it for this. Haha. -ha. Yeah. Okay, that was the one that we figured out, quote unquote, by looking at the goddamn symbol. Yeah, that was the one that I thought I actually had a thing for. Throw a series of quick jabs into the hallway. That sure is spooky in here. Yeah, it's new torch time real soon. Can we just... Fine. Can we just bring the brazier with us? <laughs> Honestly, Niles. <laughs> no, wait. Okay, so this is no different. Oh, okay. So maybe you can only have one at a time. I guess go back and do mud. Alright, but I'm trying again. Oh no, how's the old Dang! Nobody knows. It's probably fun. Okay. part of the scary, spectacular screen team. Experience. Extravaganza. The Halloween boat murdered extravaganza? Well. Buzzword. Oh, I see. I that makes more sense. My dwarf fortress on Steam, but I appreciate the man. Call for it nonetheless. Yeah, dwarf fortress. Ah, I love it, but man, are we ever not gonna make a good stream game out of that? Even when it comes out on Steam. Yeah. No promises. <laughs> I would watch somebody play it for hours, but ooh, there we go. I'm an asshole. Okay, perfect. Also, I'm big again. Hell yeah. Hello. Well, let's just e poor. Well, we can take whatever this is. The bar. Oh, it's a pry bar. Okay. Neat. No. Oh. Uh, that probably would have helped us with the gear puzzle. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... Okay, Let's save, because I think we're now officially, like, playing yeah, the game again. We are now playing <laughs> the game again instead of just running to get back to where we were at, but with less Banshee death hanging over our heads. Okay, so use pry bar. On door? Fail to accomplish much of anything. Okay. Mm. 
Hey, look, can we go somewhere from the from the sewer? Cause there was like a broken grate. Oh, was there? Kinda. Oh yeah, yeah in the middle there. Oh. Oh, the rock pile on the left. Yeah, I guess we'll try using the pry bar on that. Like we didn't have any mu much of any luck with that, but yeah, I think. <clears throat> Try the rock, but the bar slips in awkward fashion. You don't have enough leverage to move it. Of course. Hmm. I love how you got the item that grants you leverage, and the first thing you do is like, you don't have enough leverage to mm -hmm. do anything. Cool. Why do we get this then? Try to squeeze your body through the bars. After a moment or two of struggling, you give up. Okay. Well, that's fine. We can use the leverage thinger to. Or we can misclick and uh, it'll say, you strain your muscles is doing the thing. Use the bar on what? Use the bar on the bars. Okay, the bars are firmly anchored in place. Uh, can we agape it? Possibly. Can you e pour it? I don't know how oh, to e pour! Can you, can you end trays? Can you end trays the door? I guess I'll try. The air itself, you spell, nothing resulted. Fine. Oh, I guess we didn't actually uh, go back to the um, waterfall room and uh, get the cool thing from that. That's true. <laughs> By which I mean the two fucking rocks <laughs> and another skull. Okay, what was waterfall time? It was, uh... That was DMM. Oh, yeah. Wow! Skull, take cool rock, take cool rock, take hand? You can't take the hideaway. What? Oh, I guess this is the hideaway. Little bones begin to come apart. You take change your mind, deciding it best not to take the corpse. Open the corpse. Oh! You search the corpse for anything useful. For two scrolls. Okay, I'm glad we did that. I, I think we tried burning the corpse, but let's try it again. Best not to disturb the remains any further. Alright. Oh. Okay, torch is starting to flicker, so let's just uh, retorch. There we go. Retorch. That's a retorchical question. I get it. Yeah. So what do we have here? We've got another spell, neat, and brother. If you're reading this, and I am no more. Our best defenses can't hold against this power. I fear we have underestimated his ambition and the depths he would travel in the dark art to protect the seals at all costs. He must not get them. I know it is forbidden to enter each other's demiscene, but I implore you to follow the ley lines to the Lone Keep and add your strength to Unthalms. If nothing else, perhaps our Weathermaster can blunt the Evil One's advance, especially with your support. Fare thee well, Fandril the High. Our <laughs> Weathermaster. Ah, oh, he sure was Fandril the High. <laughs> Read the. Uh, it stands out. A mix! You see a glyph mix. glowing with power. Man, I wish that we had any indication as to what these spells do! Mix! Uh. Seems to imply a recipe of ingredients put together for a mysterious purpose. Okay. Mix! Yeah. Uh. See, the, the spells all kind of tell you what they do, right? Okay, because yeah. Because Agape opens something, and Treyas, I'm certain, lets you in somewhere. Yeah. Invoke can like... invokes something. Mix mixes things. Okay, well, fuck me, I guess. I'm a big dummy. <laughs> oh, do not really torch until the music sounds. Okay. Spectral person. Yeah, they do last longer if you, if you let them gutter out. Okay. Oh, 
cryptic, but... Okay. I kind of want to go back to the sewer. <laughs> okay. Because that's our newest... <laughs> You're a nasty little along. sewage girl, aren't you? <laughs> I am a nasty little sewage girl. Okay, what was sewer zone? Uh, middle up down. The fact of the matter is, it's the one room we've been to that has another route, I think. Sewer? I hardly knew her! Ah. Oh. I don't get it. And I guess we could try slinging at the... the Gerblin? I think you tried to sling at the Gerblin. I, I mean, I tried to sling at the cave thing. Maybe I just need to wait for the Gerblin to be visible. But I, I, I feel like it, it puts text up. I don't up. think we wicked need yeah. to deal with him. I guess I guess because we can't go up from there, but yeah. Can you do anything with the other gates? Uh, I know that's the broken one, but yeah, let's look at these things. Wrinkle your nose is a decaying smell wafting from the grate. Wrinkle your nose. Tiny scurrying sounds can be heard coming from beyond this grate. You shake the iron grate, noting that it appears slightly loose. Oh. Well, Okay. Then. Okay. It feels somewhat loose. Your nose is now permanently wrinkly. Oh, gross. That fucking banshee curse is getting worse. Oh, fuck me. Okay. <laughs> so you want to use it on the one that isn't broken. I mean, I guess it's implied that the, the pry bar came from here. But at the same time, it feels like, well, okay, that's that looks big enough to just go through. Yeah, it wicked does. Slosh around the ankle deep water, careful not to make too much noise. Cool, can we go this way? There we go. Peering into the darkness, you drop down into the muck and crawl through the tight opening. Oh, here's the obelisk that we were supposed Look, to be looking for. Look, it's fungus. Yeah. Stone denim is damp and smells of copes and green foliage. As if a mirage, the far side of the cave shimmers and power emanates from a standing stone obelisk. Ooh. Mushroom has an earthly, fresh dirt smell to it. I guess let's take these. Oh man, are those potion ingredients? Because I bet they're potion ingredients. Oh, they've got to be no right. Wizards, ten. Do not eat. Yeah, yeah, no kidding. Oh, yeah. This is not a game that's gonna have edible mushrooms. <laughs> Free mushrooms! <laughs> oh, fresh rooms. Uh, you know what, though? We've been good. <laughs> We've been good. Let's well, just... We deserve, we deserve a yeah, quick mushroom snack. I treat, think. treat yourself. You gulped down the mushroom, oh, choking crunchy. a bit on the acrid taste. Oh! Can't eat that. I could if cool. I tried. It looks like it just let us soft lock ourselves, probably. Yeah, it super did, I guess. So let's just load that, I suppose. <laughs> Ooh, wizard's den. Unless it's like, oh, you eat them and you die in like 50 turns or something. <laughs> Like that. <laughs> that would be so mean. Some fucking Sierra adventure game ass shit. Yeah. Stone Obelisk is nearly ten hands high, embellished with strange glyphs and three deep notches. An inner hum emanates from its center, setting your teeth on edge. Use Obelisk. That seems a rather odd thing to do. Why? I was told to come here and do something with the Obelisk, I think. What did it tell us to do? Ooh, yeah, what was it? It was, like, in the archive... Da, 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 use... Ugh, just look... Use it on our eyes. Use scroll on eyes. Seek my obelisk in the den... Da, 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 da. One of the sewers. Few more upon us if... Okay, well, we sought it. Can we call Lackmere? I guess... Can we invoke it? Did we do all the spells already? 
It's your will on the stone obelisk of the whispered world. Your spell is unleashed. Oh, shit. Ah. Ah, uh, hey, bud. Ah. Shitty wizard o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> Strange apparition coalesces from within the obelisk. The ghostly figure of an old man cloaked in a shimmering veil. Oh, we're getting a cutscene. You have done well, simple soldier. Now, listen if you have ears. I, I do. <laughs> oh, really? Most of the warlock's traps are sort of ear amputation based. You've done <laughs> well. Some forty years past, an evil, the light the world has not beheld, escaped its prison. Talimar, the black. He of whom... Talimar. Talimar. This warlock lord brought forth... Prepare to face Tali in hell. Ah, oh, he brought forth his uh, dank JPEGs. Mm -hmm. Talimar has laid waste to the combined power of man. And what of the circle of twelve? Fart ghosts. <laughs> I mean, a fart is a food ghost, so what's a fart ghost? Exactly. Um, Febreze? Temple of Doom is the worst movie than Crystal Skull. I could buy that. I hear Crystal Skull's actually not bad. Just fucking a bit bananas. Good. Hmm. It, it did turn out that Harrison Ford's son is canonically... Um, actual cannibal Shia LaBeouf, so there's that. Oh, jeez. With you, fare thee well. Okay. Oh, sorry, were you talking, Lackmere? It, it's okay, he was just saying, like, prophecy, 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 lick my orbs. Wizard magic. Vanishes, leaving behind a scroll, a glowing orb, and the words, fare thee well. Congratulations, you have earned the wizard's friend achievement. <laughs> Drop a silver orb, also known as a sorb, into your satchel. Satchel. Hey, okay, put the scroll okay. into the satchel. What's the scroll? Is it cool? I don't believe I asked to open the water. <laughs> okay, you read the words on the scroll aloud. Five to find, three are gone. One gives access to the bladed sun. The silver orb to vanish below. The staff of ages to vanquish the foe. Joining two, the golden thorn. The last to invoke the platinum horn. Cool. cool. Uh, is this the Staff of Ages? I think that's, I think that's like the big riddle. Mm -hmm. It's kind of a I big old riddle. I think that's the scepter of bitches. Can we look at that orb that we just got? Yeah, absolutely. This the orb. orb has a silver sheen about it. It's relatively light and vibrates with the dormant expectant power. Dormant expectant power. The orb is too big to jet. Seriously, what are you <laughs> thinking? It's only what are you thinking? <laughs> It looks like a jawbreaker, <laughs> man. I read, yeah, I read about this thing on Tumblr where you could put a light bulb in your mouth and not take it out again. And it just, <laughs> this orb reminded me of that. And I just figured, hey, why not? <laughs> Everything else wants to kill me. <laughs> jawbreaker, Eddie. Okay, well, we do have another uh, cool skull to put into a place. Let's go and do that. Let's do it. Let's do it about it. Okay, I don't know what this does for us, but there it go. Remembering a past Temple of Doom moment of sneaking up and shouting Kali Ma while holding a beef heart. Woof. made our arm hair stand on end, so that's useful. Oh, did it? Oh, neat. <laughs> I must have missed that. I was just like, we've already I put this in on, here once. I stand on it so hard that they pop off and you bleed out from your hair holes. Go see oh. the Grim Reaper, asshole. Shadowgate. <laughs> I kind of like the thought that the hair, hairs just pop off and impale whatever's nearby. <laughs> oh, like it's our Angela. Mm-hmm. sort of reinvigorated my arachnophobia with that. Oh, beans. Oh, yeah. Fancy. Yeah, like so mirrors. these are... God, I don't... I have such a hard time remembering what mirrors are. <laughs> I think I have a condition. 
Mirror, mirror on the... You begin before Yorick interrupts and says, No, 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 there'll be only one talking at object in this adventure. And I wish it was the mirror. <laughs> you mop your brow of the sweat that glistens there and you say to your reflection, This is getting intense. Yorick agrees enthusiastically and says, Intensely smelly! You need a bath! <laughs> Fuck you! That third mirror may be interesting. Oh, okay. Reflections say I'm good enough, I'm smart enough, and doggone it, people like you, Yorick finishes for you. <laughs> it really looked that bad, you ask your reflection. Unfortunately, Yorick answers by saying, yep! Pull around and ask playfully, does this make me look fat? Yorick just sighs in response. Whoops, whoops, whoops. I could do with a shave. Silky smooth. <laughs> All this and brains too. Okay, right. <laughs> Enough for that. <laughs> that was fun. Fun little Actually, that's, a, that's a good point, because, like, uh. Like. Why well, might you swing the hammer at the mirror? Oddly enough, the mirror weapon just bounces off the glass. Perhaps the mirror is enchanted. Except it's not good. Uh, oh, what if we use a cool spell on it? Ooh. Like. Entries? Actually, the glyph in your mind, or at least the power of the spell. Pretty fireworks and a headache, but little else. Dang it. Mm. Uh, I thought I'm some of the lit up ones. Worth a shot. What if we invoke, like, because there's supposedly something in this mirror. Specialize the glyph in your mind and just, just, uh, release the spell, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Intros on the iron door. It's worth a shot. I'm, I'm thinking I've tried that before, but... Yeah, no. That torch of yours needs some attention, boy. Shut up, Yorick! Shut up, Yorick. But... Oh jeez, excuse me. That was that was oh, Yorick. Goodness. That was, that was Yorick. Yorick. Mirror, mirror on the mirror. Who's the mirror of mirror? Just like hmm. <clears throat> Buffalo, Buffalo, and the Buffalo. Nope. So we've used that key. We've used that key. This key we've not found a door for. Yeah. Snow White's evil queen right after a stroke. Jesus. Okay, wand on the mirror. Yeah, sure. Bye. Wand on the mirror. To do anything constructive. Nothing. Nothing. Uh. We're stuck again, I think. Stuck again, I think. We've got such a collection of skulls as well. Yeah, I. We should. Hmm. Well, hold on. Let's see. Did putting. Oh yeah, epores just written there. So. Epore, epore. I am very excited to learn what the big deal of epore is. <laughs> Crusty Wizard did give us like a thing. Should we just rub the thing on some things? Yes, like he gave us this big fucking orb. Did he give us a scroll? Oh yeah, he gave us a fucking puzzle. Nope. James, while John had 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 a better effect on the teacher. Oh. <sighs> Silver orb. Yeah, the silver orb is the thing that the wizard gave to us. Um. Oh yeah, James, while well, John had had had, and had had had, had 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 a better effect on the teacher. Can I try and walk backwards through this? <laughs> you attempt to go through the door behind you, but... Okay, uh -huh. yep, fair. 
Ah, <laughs> oh, my butt! <laughs> my butt! My butt is... Elven Funhouse! Something about Elven Funhouse begets for me such a kind of like pulp fantasy feel. For sure. <laughs> like somebody wrote like a one of those novels with some really great like the the beer and chips wizard on the cover. <laughs> where their biggest dip into fantasy has just been the Renaissance Festival, so <laughs> I don't know, it's something great. Ooh, the orb on the fire chalice. Oh. It does look like it would fit in there, yeah. Okay, use orb on. Thing is happening after a few minutes, you stop trying to use a silver orb on the brazier. Cool. Can we use mushroom on water? Nothing happened when you used the mushroom. We did on the attempt bottom. to eat the orb. I think it was slightly too big for our mouth. Yeah, yeah. Pry the brazier. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's just. Uh... The orb is too big to ingest. Seriously, what are you thinking? Sure, how funny. Oh, sure, how funny. Uh oh! Ah, spooky. Searing flames for the brazier. Keep his arm's length. Cannot pry the brazier. Can't do anything constructive with the campfires. Nope. So what is? Can we chuck it at this at the obelisk skeleton? <laughs> Can we break his break his face? Like the orb? Maybe. Hmm. It's got like magic runes. Maybe we throw it at the runes and they're like, Wow, I've absorbed the power of a dead guy. Maybe. Okay. What if we invoke... Nope. Okay. It's still nothing that way. Entrance on that water. That's not a bad plan, actually. Let's try that. Ooh, can you use the orb on the orb? The... the elemental? Maybe. It's worth a shot. Drink drawing power from here itself. Annoying headache, nothing. Okay. I feel like we need to, like, freeze the water or something there. That's my... that's my dim memory. Yeah... Like... There's the ice elemental. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so... Use orb on this guy. Oh! 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 Power from within the artifact immediately pulls the entity inside. Beads of water. Oh, it was a Pokeball! <laughs> what? It was a Pokeball all along! Silver orb is so slippery, it's hard to. The essence of. Ah, <laughs> oh, crack that fucker over that brazier now. <laughs> Absolutely. I don't know what that's gonna do for us, but we sure can do it. <laughs> we're, we're now gonna have an out. Torch. Oh my god. Use this on that. Nice from the silver orb okay. trails a spray of water that quickly extinguishes the fire in the brazier. Neat! Is there something cool in the brazier? It's a metal brazier as well. <laughs> Can we just take the brazier now? It's rooted in place. Well. We sure, we sure have an out brazier now. Yeah, now we have to take the the other one to the other place. Yeah. <sighs> oh Ooh, yeah. That's a good that's point. That's a good ass point, actually. Okay. Uh, what if I like try use mushroom? Oh, you. I don't like how often it refers to the legs of that thing. Is that going to be important? <laughs> I hope not. Mushroom failed to do anything constructive to the brazier. Okay, what if we do... You just shake the mushroom at it like, it's not working! <laughs> I 
Okay, stop trying to use the bottom of the brazier. Yeah, I mean, I guess that we don't really have a cauldron, so that's as good a place as any. Yeah. Okay. Still worried about when we're gonna find this freaking cure. Yeah, same. Oh, hey, bud. Oh, it's you again. I see you have. Still, you have managed to overcome them and make it this far. While this guy's while this guy's monologuing, I'm gonna real quick just run to the bathroom and be right back. Okay. Oh no, you've left me alone with this evil warlock. Oh no, it's gone. Oh, oh, you left me in the room with a giant frozen spider. This is pretty cool. How's chat doing tonight? Are you all afraid of spiders too? Because I'm afraid of spiders. We're going to have to do something with it. This is nice and cozy in here. This is kind of my preferred temperature. I just kind of lays out in here on the ice. I just sort of bounce frictionlessly across. We got trapped in the face, sir. No. Oh, Team Retrofox. Hey, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're currently trapped inside of a freezer, but it's fine. You're welcome into the freezer, too. Extra body heat's gonna keep us all from death. <laughs> Hello. Hello, everybody. We are playing Shadowgate. Specifically, we are playing a remake of Shadowgate, which is a very, very, very old game that uh, is very scary and spooky. You can tell because of the scary spider and the skull and uh, probably some other... Th if you're afraid of torches, there's a torch there you can be scared of. It's a good time. Jax is, Jax is having a bit of a, a bit of a piss. Ah, oh, Red. Oh, I'm glad some people are showing up who actually know this game. See, I played it... I. I played it a long time ago when I was a kid. I got it as a gift when I was recovering from something in the hospital. And um, it was good. It spooked me. I had it on my Game Boy Color. I think it was Color. Maybe it was just Game Boy. I don't even remember at this point. But it was it was really good. And this version, I mean, I kind of wish you could just play the original. But, um, yeah, it's still Shadow Game. Yeah, I'm back. Oh, and it's still Jax. Despite yeah. everything, it's still you. Oh, um... Team Retrofox is raided with a party of five. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, Team Retrofox, thanks for the raid. Hope your yeah. game went good. And it's time to hydrate also. Oh. Hydrate time. Sippy. Oh. Ooh. I just the last of my strawberry cheesecake tea. And I oh. have it's good stuff. Now, I heard you talking an awful lot when I was uh, booting my boot away. I was just trying to keep people entertained. I was afraid of spiders, and I was skiing <laughs> on the ice, and, oh. you know, and You were upset that I'd left you in the freezer. <laughs> With the spiders. <laughs> oh. Yeah! Oh, we- oh. whoops, whoops, whoops. Whoops. Excellent work! Was it? I guess we're glad we did it in that specific order, huh? Mm-hmm. See the outline of your magical orb frozen just below the surface. I mean, we might have just dropped it down the fucking chasm. Oh, oh, spent all of your beans making us not say it. Like today. Oh. I think you see oh a sky change to the rock. I don't see the the word band thing. Are you yeah, sure? Me either. Get, yeah, go to the skeleton. Oh, it was oh, a few streams, streams back. back. Okay. <laughs> I'm a dead guy. <laughs> the skeletal <laughs> remains. Cool <laughs> Some unfortunate soul are chained securely to this rock. The torch's flame momentarily flickers. Oh, right. Well, I want that key. I, I guess you can have my key. <laughs> oh, is this going to be a cool spell? You cannot read the inscription on the rock. You understand its intent to warn others away. Oh, okay. Really? Yeah, it was the inscription that did that. You untie the blindfold from the skeleton's head and place it in your pack. Uh, hey, it was getting so dark in here. A knuckle made from black iron is secured around the skeleton's wrist. Ooh, can we use that unknown key on the manacles? I don't know why we would, but... That would be wild. Nothing were <laughs> to ever be considered a skeleton key, it would be this. Womp, womp. Womp, womp. I mean, oh, we wound up going into caveman speak. Yeah, that... That sounds bad. Yeah. 
Yeah. It's welded together. Okay. Cool. Second thought, you decide against serving poor tortured soul. Eat him. Oh, okay, <laughs> oh, I, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Eat the skeleton. You really aren't that hungry. <laughs> you have to be very hungry to eat, not food. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we got another key. Yeah, I guess we're gonna go and try the one other door that uh, we can't <laughs> yet unlock. Here's hoping. Okay. Well, this had better be it, otherwise I'm gonna be very upset. Ah. Oh. Hey. Progress! Oh, a wave of heat slams into you as you move into the next Whoa. room. Dang! Intense heat surely from the unearthly fire before you fills this large room. Oh! Scorching fire quickly becomes unbearable. You make a hasty retreat for the door behind you. Oh, this room! <laughs> anyway, you remember the Elven Funhouse? Jeez. <laughs> asshole. Uh, blindfold over your eyes, partially obscuring your vision. Cool. Well, it does for us, but okay. It didn't, so I guess we can leave it on. Okay, so... I mean, I guess there was, like, position three of those cool, cool, uh, puzzle thing? Yeah. Oh, torch time. Man, we need to find a new torch place soon. Yeah, we super do. Is, Is there anything else that we can do with that brazier? Because why would that be the end of that? Yeah. And those runes too. There's got we've got like three of them now. I guess I don't know what we would do with them, but Yeah. But I still gotta somehow get across there. Somehow. Possibly up with the goblork. Mm-hmm. So the other one was up down middle, I think. Yeah, yeah. And I don't remember what, if anything, that does. We don't know yet. But we don't, I don't think we need to go to the other places anymore. Well, I guess the other one had those other two rooms and it didn't it, so maybe. But yeah. for now, because we certainly can't do anything of them right now. Down middle. Okay, so that's a hum of power, a faraway rattle of chains, followed by the rumble of rushing water. So my hope is that that's oh. gonna, like, quench the stuff. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and we took an opportunity to attack. Okay, this will be full up again. But we can still just go. Whoop. Yeah. Oh, fun house. Okay, so it's still bad. Okay. Uh. What does your have to say? That's some bullshit about mirrors. I'm sure, I hint hints next. Yeah, give me some hints. Yeah, yeah. It's cloaked in mystery. You'll need something to keep. Oh, are we not wearing the cloak? Oh, we super are wearing the cloak. Do we need to make the cloak damp? Oh, we need to soak the cloak? Drench the cloak with water from the bottle. Jesus Christ. Christ. Dang, okay. No, that, that actually makes sense. That's less yeah, moon logic. It... Yeah. Ten seats surely from the unearthly fire before you. Is a large room. Okay, so let's just go. Oh, a bright uh -oh. point of white light materializes above the bridge, with a coral and heat behind it. 
The swirl of fire, the singularity explodes and fashions itself into a creature out of your worst nightmares. The beast hisses at you, blocking your way. Okay, we probably want that cool shield instead of the wood shield at this point. Yeah, probably, huh? Uh, look at... It's a fire drake, a dragon from the nether regions of hell, made from nothing more than fire and molten rock. Uh... I mean, we could use, well, uh, oh, use spear on dragon. That sounds good. Oh, nope! <laughs> oh, that sounded bad. Ah, oh. oh, Ripley, you just shreds shreds cooking. And cooking you at the same time. Epor. Ah, oh, if only we had Epor. Oh, is that just fucking rope? It's rope, isn't it? I'll never tell. <laughs> okay, so... And what if we soft-locked ourselves? We don't know it yet. I should hope. Because, like, one of it's just use water sprite on the fucking big bad fire drake. I don't... See, I, I can't speak to the remake, though. I don't... I, I know the, the first game, or the, the actual Shadowgate, didn't... I don't think it really let you softlock yourself like that. Okay, well that's something at least. Maybe there was a few things that you could do, but I don't know. That seems that seems crummy. Mm -hmm. Every item usually has one specific use. Yeah, that's that's usually my understanding too. So I, I think we're good. Just maybe you wanna. Have a, a nice little save before we. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Maybe, maybe York can help us. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaking to the bridge accomplishes nothing. Go to it, boy. Yeah, we know. Ba, 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 ba. Cool dragon. There's nightmares, it hisses. That creature draws powers from the flames below. Hmm. For the water on the flames, it has no effect. I th thought that was gonna do it too, but <laughs> the sound. Of... Jesus. Okay. I guess a spell's gotta be the gotta do it, huh? So it beats your brows, you concentrate on the glyph and release a spell. Immediately a nauseating smell assaults your senses. Ugh. Oh cool. Oh. You just cast fart cloud on self. I guess. Fire Drake doesn't hear you. <sighs> can't attack it directly. You need to do something with the fire itself. What if we... Can you recapture the water elemental? We'd have to get the... No, the elemental is gone and the orb is gone. I think the elemental's back. The orb's just kind of in the ice, though. Oh, is it really? Oh, okay. Let's... Well, if that's the case, then yeah. yeah. Let's see if we can get the orb out of the ice. Yeah. Cloak is no longer wet. That's actually good to know. Yeah. Is there a reason why it put that stupid shield barrier wall there, other than to just make things take longer? Yeah, right. 
Okay, so... Sorb. You have a prime... Back away the spear, the ice is too thick. Dulling your blade... Yeah, okay, so... The lit torch melts the ice around the silver uh, ore, freeing it. The ancient arch might rise to the surface of the frozen okay. lake. Okay. Okay, yeah, this is definitely it then. Okay, nice. Okay. Cool, cool, right, cool. I assume those were gone forever. <laughs> no, thankfully not. Guess not. All right, cool. Uh, remember to get some water again. Oh yeah, yeah. I guess we never did really look upon the orb to figure out what it was supposed to do. No, we we did look at it. And it's just like it it. It vibrates with latent energy or whatever. Mm. Dormant energy. I was like, okay, cool. Yeah, we figured it was a magic orb. <laughs> yeah, right. Like, no, I just watched those like tinfoil polishing videos on YouTube. Ah! I thought you'd like my best one yet. <laughs> Make a neat tinfoil orb. <laughs> anyway, a fun storm in the castle. Make a cool orb out of tinfoil. Well, I gotta go crystal up some billies already. <laughs> This, this is my latest orb, it's called Billy. <laughs> okay, right. Use silver orb on... Okay, the water element immediately extinguishes the flame of the fire pit before disappearing. The effect on the fire drake is disastrous. Unable to feed upon the magical flames, the dragon's power ebbs, and the thing vanishes as a cloud of acrid smoke and feeble sparks. Ba da 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 Six little bit for children so it finally opens. Now we're actually in Shadowgate, I think. Oh, nice. This must be it. The Shadow Gate. That's the Shadow Gate. It kind of sucks. Mm -hmm. Ancient wrought iron grate race rests securely within its craft carb. Oh, hey. Oh, this Great. must be the chains. The chain. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Back we go. Do we have to wet our fucking cloak again? I hope not. Uh, no, it looks like the flames are dimmed enough mm -hmm. that we should be good. Maybe we can put some of the nasty sewer water in the bottle as well. It doesn't it's have possible. to be the... It doesn't look that bad, honestly. It looks like it's powering. Yeah, it does. Oh, yep, there we go. Alright. Is it different at all? Just water. Okay, neat. Game does not judge you for <laughs> drinking sewer water. Yay! Finally, a game that doesn't judge me for who <laughs> I am. A nasty I'm little sewage girl. <laughs> okay, what was it? It was like okay, uh, down. Down middle, I think. Yeah. Uh, rumble of chains. All power. All power. Cloak is no longer wet. Cloak is no longer wet. God, we need some more torches badly. We really do. Nerd! I'll get you one of these times. <laughs> Zelda. Why does that transition take so much longer than all the others? I don't know. What's so difficult about rendering the. Hey, maybe the this is. Yeah. Now, are we going to get forced back? Oh no, okay. Don't have to make our cloak wet. Okay, well, this did not do the thing that I thought it was going to do. Yeah, it sure didn't. An empty spot here. The key part of this mechanism is missing. Oh, we need to find a gear somewhere. Well, I know where some gears is. That's true. Oh, we have the pry bar now. Maybe that will just pry one of those gears loose. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Don't mind us, we're just going to transition a few times. <laughs> just Wait, hang on. <laughs> just try a few things out. Girl, boy, girl, boy, girl, boy, girl, boy, girl. <laughs> We've 
descended. <laughs> We've got to have so many gender reveal parties that we start the third impact. Okay, that's, that's not good. Wraith. I think it's a banshee rather than a wraith. Banshee, whatever. Banshee. Okay, right. Use. Pry bar on that one. Use pry bar on that one. Use pry bar on that one. Yeah! Yay! Oh, it's a faulty gear. Well, how the fuck were oh. we supposed to know it was faulty? Hmm. Whatever, video game. Because I know we looked at all those gears was and was one just of like... The only ones that was actually moving. Why would that be the fault? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we looked at all those fucking gears and it was just like, This is a gear! Look at it go! <laughs> uh. <sighs> Cryptic ass goddamn video game. <laughs> I know! It reminds you of the King Otto's Fair... Please, just let me click on the scene rather than the text box to continue. God! Oh Christ, are we gonna have to put this here? Sigh of relief, the gear slips into place with the click. Can we just, like, use these? Can we pull this chain? Oh, there's tiny chains. This is a deceased your efforts. I mean, the only thing that we know that does things with chains is. Ooh, hey! length of metal bar appears to have broken off from the iron grate. I guess we'll take that. It's ours now. <laughs> it's neat. Why is this different from the pry bar? Cool. Yeah, it does, bud. <laughs> We've got two know. different bars of metal. <laughs> Can you use bar on self? Let's pry ourselves open. Let's open our third eye. <gasps> Don't smack yourself on the head with the bar. Not your finest hour. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Okay, what is what is the description for the the gate say? Uh Can we look at it. Wrought iron gate rests securely with its curved carved iron carved stone frame. I guess let's just try using the bar on the gate. I hope to use the bar as a lever, you jam it into the base. Unfortunately the grate doesn't budge. You can't just pull on the chains? tried pulling on the chains, it was like, nah. -uh. Hit this one. Grab hold, hanging on the chains with a fuel. Nope, okay. Not that one either. Is one of our increasingly dubiously named open spells. <laughs> I know, right? Um... <laughs> I got... Use entries. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Dang, I that actually worked. I just wasn't expecting that. Didn't think that was going to do it. Firmly attached to the wall, this room glows with power. Great. No, no, we I'm just opened that. Guy. Oh, great. Ancient skeletons, one of the inhabitants of the castle. Open the skeleton. Rolled piece of parchment, so it takes your fancy. What's the rolled piece of piece How of parchment? To cure banshee sauce. <laughs> God, that would be nice. Brother Dyden. Brother Delden. Oh. Please see to it that the circle chamber is prepared for the ritual. The circle dais was in need of some repair the last time we performed the initiate spell on it. We have a young candidate ready for initiation. Watch the rides perform the platform. Please bestow upon him all authority and privilege commensurate with an acolyte of the order. The sign with an ac archaic letter L. No, it's Lark um, or whatever. Yeah, it's that guy. Oh my god, is he a bad guy all the time? I don't think so. Like I think <laughs> I think the bad the bad men took over this place. Yeah. Okay, I don't think there's anything oh, more constructive we can do with that corpse, so. Oh, another cool obelisk. And still no Ooh. more torches. Yeah, unfortunately. 
fortress. Twelve stone thrones. So this is like the circle of the twelve wizards or something. Power mm -hmm. pulsates from mystical symbols set within the floor. Ooh, this is where we need that one scroll. A thousand Ooh. percent. A thousand percent. Check out the thing on the floor. Oh, yeah. The, the fucking... The, the three and the crown and the two past midnight and the whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, five to find, three or one. one. Oh, here we are. Okay. Much of the scroll has faded, one part still stands out. And in the end, the evil shall be thrice defeated and thrice returned. The first shall raise a warder to bar the gates from opening. The second shall raise one of the carefree people to travel the carefree to travel the path of luck. The last shall raise a raven to remake what was undone. The letter is signed with Gabriel and includes a glyph which shows four vertical lines of varying height. Neat. <laughs> like Lost? <laughs> like the bars on a phone? <laughs> Ravage's throne is ornately carved and decorated with runes. Many of the symbols on this chair are of avian design. This particular throne has been partially destroyed. A sense of power about it. Disrepair, this throne stands out for the rest. Carvings within the stone are extremely deep. A dizzying number of strange runes, the vast majority you've never seen before, carved in the circular dais. A hum of power emanates from its center along with a ghostly whisper of a word a censure. Oh no, we're being censured. No, no, this this game was built, put together by Accenture. Ah. <laughs> Stupid joke. <laughs> Dumb joke. Bad joke. <laughs> your eyes roll back into your heads. You focus your will on the stone obelisk. You whisper the word Invocan and unleash the spell. A black mirror materializes from inside the obelisk. Time for another cutscene. Time for a cutscene! Were they, were they? <laughs> were they originals? Were they, were they? I remain. Well, he well, who well. is called Timeless. I have fought the good fight, sending many of Talimar's horde back to the depths that spawned them. And though my power is beyond that of mortal man, it is not without limit. Uh huh. Why? Why do Why is your power suck? Before you thus, am I a ghost? <laughs> no. <laughs> Surely I am. <laughs> well, bud, you know what you are. Is not but a he forgot to plug himself <laughs> in. Being has shelter within my tower. It is here I continue my studies to aid you in what ways I can. Okay. I grow have another Pokeball. But know this, I have glimpsed a vast power at the foundation of this castle. This power the Warlock Lord covets above all else. But he fears as well. A hero from the line of the, the power ancients. Power is lava. <laughs> oh. So says Gabriel. Power is soup. Bard. Danger soup. Danger soup. Gird yourself Rock against soup. what is to come, simple soldier. And forsake me not. Hey, cool. me. Yeah. The ways of the circle. Stray not from its path. I don't think we're going to make a lot of progress if we don't stray from the circle's path. <laughs> I know. <laughs> we're going to be wandering around <laughs> this one room. Okay. Stray Bye. not from its path. This form fades away to nothing. Neat! Well, that accomplished nothing. I guess if we walk in a circle long enough, then we'll make a hole all the way down to the foundations of the castle. You know, yeah. Well, that was exciting. Uh, can we just, like, use this? You play around the dais after a moment, you stop having grown bored. Oh, great. Sorry we bored you. Go the top of the stairs blocks your way. Well, open it then. Jesus! <laughs> I hope this is the torch room. I like the image oh. in your dreams, the entrance to the inner keep of Castle Shadowgate stands before you, set with a heavy wooden drawbridge. So it's there she blows. This is Hey, there's another symbol. Ooh, yeah, okay. So is this at long last finally the thing that does the 
Oh, in fact, look at that. That's muddy bottom of the moat looks far from inviting. So we raised oh, we drained the, the moat. I think we drained the moat. Oh, it's a werewolf. Neat. It's a were moat. Rope hangs from the wooden crossbar. Uh, take rope. The pungent stench of melted. A stubborn knot comes free and the rope falls to the ground. Neat. I mean, it, it mentioned like chains and uh, water, so. Oh, maybe it does both or something. Yeah. I feel like well, that's a bad mechanism. Like, yeah. Thing one, you're putting the controls for your drawbridge and your moat ahead of your castle rather than inside of it. Yeah, and also. It should be kind of reversed. <laughs> yeah. Because not like the door is up, but also they can just walk across mm -hmm. now. Impossible to do that. All these years, the castle still looks impressive, Yorick says in admiration. I'm glad you're impressed, dude. Okay, well we have a rope. Was there anything that we needed a rope for? Can we use them to cross gaps? E poor, e poor, e poor, e poor. Mm. It's 20 hands long. That's a lot of hands. <sighs> this room glows with power. It sure does, bud. It sure does. I mean, what if we, like, use rope on Epor? <laughs> Understandable. See, my memory is that Epor was actually one of the magic spells that you got, and it just made, like, a happy rope appear. Oh. I, so I, the fact that you didn't get the spell Epor by reading those runes, I don't... Oh! You pat down know. the corpse, your rope oh. handling produces a piece of parchment and a scroll which you put in your back. Okay, what do we got? Seek ye the black axe. This brittle parchment contains not, not a faded illustration of five words, seek the black axe. Okay. Read the message scrolled on the page. Brown, I have your dog. If you wish to see the flying ace again, then bring the skulls and squash I require to the place beyond the pumpkin door. But be wary, for only one outfitted for the Hallowed Eve can gain entrance. There you must carve my visage and illuminate the sacrifices before preforming the spell of invocation. Then I'll be freed and this will all end. Cordially, DP. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Excuse me, what? That kind of sounds like that's, like... We have to dress up in a Halloween costume, make a jack-o'-lantern, yeah. and then put some candles and some skulls? Sounds like it. Oh, was he in the wrong game? Oh. <laughs> uh oh. I... One of the, the things I, I do recall is having this... The dumb thought, I guess sparked by, like, oh, I... Those, those like, Twitter posts that are like, oh, you were in the last game you played, what's, what's up? And I keep thinking, you know, if something like that were to happen and, like, me and, like, you and me and everybody just kind of showed up at the doors outside of Shadowgate, oh my God. I would just be like, oh, oh, shit, ah, oh, piss, oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> I imagine it would have gone much like this has gone, which is like, yeah, I, I remember, oh, no, <laughs> we've been killed 30 times. I mean, look. If we turn up in Shadowgate and we're stuck in another world with our mobile phones, we can at least look up game FAQs. <laughs> That's true. Okay, yeah, King Otto's fair. I need to go back and get the broken gear. Quote unquote broken, because apparently we need this gear. Oh, we need the faulty gear? It won't work? Yeah. Gotta be rooted in place. Just to pry it out again? Is that going to close the gate again? Oh, I'm going to be so fucking mad if it does. Okay, good. <sighs> 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 I 
God. Uh, sure, hope that <laughs> that care is pretty soon. Uh, yeah, right. Cause damn. That's what we get for playing it. Oh, we got roped into this adventure because the uh... the, the funny and the the e poor. <laughs> Epor, Epor, Epor. Okay, rushing water deeper than the castle. There we go. Right. Okay, so that's the lever and the, the thing in different state. So Hold up. Save right here, ish. Just in case, if it's not, we don't have to come all the way back here. That's an excellent fucking point. Why would they give us a map and not let us use it to fast travel? I can't believe them. Yeah. Well, he trying though, isn't he? That he's cool sure. little gobbler. Just... he's... oh, Jesus. Oh, yes. I think that's where you needed e in the game. Yeah. It's like it, it said it on the wall there, and you're like, okay, I cast e and then a happy little rope lets you climb up the thing. <laughs> Which seems kind of redundant, really, because it's like you get the e -por Well, okay. So. Okay, so now you got the awful shark water. Mm -hmm. Foul smell rises from the stained gent wobber. Drink it! Drink it, drink it, drink it, drink it, drink it. I should leave her keys about the trinket. A thick layer of some disgusting substance to cover it. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Oh, spell! Julie is so fucking right. Oh. Uh, let's see. Hang on. Because I. There we go. Because we absolutely made no progress since this one. Yeah. And I don't want to have to backtrack it. Well, I guess we did put the, the mechanism back together. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, our open spells. What's it? Okay. Not that one. How about this one? What? Why does it work with some doors but not all doors? Because hashtag not all doors? Sure. Oh, rope through an open window, that's a... Yeah, can you throw the rope at some stuff? Oh, maybe if we use rope on arrow and throw that through... The thing? Ooh. Okay. Nope. Okay, well, what about... Metal bar? Nope. Spear might indeed yeah. be better, actually, yeah. Uh... Fuck off, Yorick! Thank you. Okay. I guess let's just try the rope itself. Use rope on window. Try and swing the rope over your head to gain the momentum needed to make it to the window. The problem is the end is not weighted enough to do any good. Okay, so we're on the right track. So we need to e pour. We need to weigh down the rope. Do we just tie the fucking hammer to the rope? <laughs> no. Would do it. No. The rock. The room? This? A sword? Our multitude of skulls? <laughs> This is frustrating, man. Hmm. Does our skull boy have anything more to say about it? Drawbridge may be closed, but isn't there, if only there was a way to reach those windows. Maybe you could put something together that would help. Try looking around the caves. There must be something down there you can use. Okay. Is there a bucket by the well? I don't Let's look. see mm. a bucket by the well. 
Can we go down the well? Well, let's try and go down the well. <laughs> yes! Well, yes. <laughs> yes, we can. <laughs> no time to register, there's no water for your head that stones in the bottom and explodes like a rotten oh, pumpkin. No! Our head explodes from well. Well, oh, well, well, well. I did it for her. <laughs> I think we both did it. Girls is the same. <sighs> yeah, we've grown fed off the same low hanging fruit. <laughs> okay, so that was a good idea. Mm -hmm. I think. Oh, wait a sec. Hang on. What if we just put the fucking gear on it? Okay. On the one hand, I'm going to be a little bit upset if that's the solution. It, it seems like a lot of uses for the gear. But we can give it a shot. And it have like a little... What? Wrong, oh, wrong one. I guess it doesn't have a little thing in the middle. Oh, we didn't get the rope this time. <gasps> this time oh no, you have to get the rope. <laughs> I thought you had to burn the rope. Oh yeah. Hey! <laughs> I have something we can try. <laughs> oh, beans! You dropped that dope rope in your... Oh, my. Wow. It must be wet. Oh, nothing like... What, a hundred feet of wet rope? Oh. Okay. So the gear didn't do it. We said the caves, so I guess let's have another look-see at the caves. Baba Booey. <laughs> Thank you for 10 Boba bits, Cora. Boo Boba Booey. Is that like... It's my favorite kind of tea. It's boba tea that's buoy flavored. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh, it's all buoy like chewy. Plastic and seawater. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Okay, veins of light color rock are pressed into the darker granite. That's exciting. Veins of light colored rock. Oh! Uh huh. Oh, go back. You go into the caves. Uh, this way? And you keep, you keep going. Go to the bridges. Go hang out with our friend Jeff Bridges. Oh, right, right, right. Oh, those are the caves, right? That's what the caves. I think are. this whole place is technically caves because it, it's yeah. like the mountain, partially. There's our... Okay, we are. I've remembered something, and I'm mad, and I'm upset, and I'm mad. <sighs> Here. Must find a cure. I kept talking about the heckin' fucking stupid legs on this stupid heckin' fucking thing. Uh huh. Oh! What the fuck? Throw it's just a through. fucking grappling hook! It's just a grappling hook. <laughs> Great. <laughs> The bowl as oh, well. Cool. Now, if we need to go sledding down a mountain later, mm -hmm. it's just a... we did pry bar that thing. We used the small pry bar, so I guess it sucked. <laughs> King adventure games. You might have pried its bar when the fire was still burning too. I don't know. Oh, maybe. Like, I was thinking. Oh, okay. The game's at least giving me a hint that we're on the right track when. We were trying to put the rope through the window, and then, uh... I mean, it, 
It was. I mean, it was. Yeah, but like in a lot of other cases, just not been giving any little, hey, you're on the right track with this idea, so just, you know, try something else. Yeah. Okay, there better be some goddamn, um... Playing an expertise you did not know you possess. You swing the grappling hook about your head a few times, let it fly. The hook catches into the window, so to the castle wall. Oh great, well now it's on the other side. That's fine, we drain the moat. Oh, I guess that's true, huh? Use the window and rope on me. You Use the rope on itself. Uh, oh. Whoop. <laughs> well, that was fun. Okay. <laughs> Try I that guess again. Go I guess go window. Yeah, go window. Maybe you should cast e poor. I've cast e poor. Ah. Ooh. Still no torches. There is a bone and apparently houses the mechanism that raises and lowers the drawbridge. A hum of parrot. There is a bone. Coal. Yeah. Oh, that okay, might be looks like, like for a... boiling oil. Yeah, I was gonna say that's oil, oil boil. Yeah. Oil boil! Mm -hmm. Let's take this and get a load of it. Into your eyes. My friend. My friend. Arrest the wizard Greylord, you <laughs> fucking <laughs> Greylord. <laughs> my, my friend, I will remain secure in my demison here in the Gatekeeper Mountains, girl bossing the northern passage and gaslighting my signal pyre. If more come from the north, I, re I regret that I must bring my most formidable pet with me, since only I can control it. The name Unthalm is signed in a flourish at the bottom of the page. Of <laughs> yeah. Okay, use. Pull the lever to the right with the rumble, the chains, but the, the drawbridge does a thing. Uh, open. Is empty. Use. Whoops. Sometimes lift's called when you feel an uncomfortable pull in your side. Okay, well, that's fine. We open Great. these crates. Killing. Pry bar and crates. Oh, sweet! I only jam the. in the hopes of opening the crate. It looks more open. I mean, look at it, it's kind <laughs> of... Just... Some ruffian has vandalized this wooden crate. <laughs> A crime has happened here. I went through the busted uh, crate searching for oh, anything okay. useful. Oh. I guess there's nothing further to do with it. Oh. Searching for anything useful. I love that it just doesn't wow. say anything. It, actually, Julie's right. Let's hit it with a fucking hammer. <laughs> oh, fuck off! Oh, God. Oh, sorry, I keep clicking out of this by accident. <laughs> okay. Take that. Go that way. Finally find some torches, but these look like they're lever torches. You've earned the infiltrator achievement. Oh, hi, hi, bud. Ooh. A goblin jumps out, surprising you with a war cry. Well, you <laughs> had all the beast tightens its grip on its weapon. Uh. More speed than you thought possible. The Gerblin anticipates your move and brings down a wickedly pointed cudgel. My penetrates deep into your brain, puts an end to your brief yet adventure-filled life. Okay. Hey. Which of our weapons is going to be the one? <laughs> shield. Oh, maybe shield first, yeah. And we do have a shield on us. I guess we could try yeah, shield guess we, bashing we've, him. We've been auto popping the shield when we needed it, huh? Mm -hmm. We have a gun? Huh. Oh, we have a sling. It's probably gonna be like. one of the keys. We have to like shove it up its nose and then it <laughs> disappears or whatever. I mean, I guess just sword. 
I have to take time to. Uh, I was scared, Goblin. I want to get a. I'm gonna do a quick Google search here and see if I can find what the original Goblin looks like. Oh my God. <laughs> the original Goblin. The original Goblin. Nilbog the original. Okay, uh, uh, Goblin bars your way deeper into the castle. Look at Goblin. The ugliest you've ever seen. Okay, let's, I guess, try use a shield on Goblin. Nope! <laughs> I feel like you, I feel like I feel like the sword on the goblin. Yeah, let's just try sword on goblin. I mean, like, it feels like the game's just gonna fucking punish us for that, but you know. Well. Okay. Fist? Hit Goblin. <laughs> Just hit him? Oh, bribe with... Get him. Bribe with coin is an interesting point, actually. Ooh. I mean, we've been assuming these are coins. This is an ancient gold coin, one that bears the faded image of a thief from long dead. As you rub dust from the gold coin, its lightweight surprises you. This is a piece of uh, banshee care bread. <laughs> okay, well, doesn't like coins. He anticipated our bribe and killed us at it. <laughs> I am incorruptible! Bow! <laughs> I didn't find any good pictures. I remember there being a good goblin. Okay, quick load is F9. I'm sure that I've been pressing that and getting nothing as soon as uh, as soon as it gets us into the death mode. Fun. Yeah. You know, we took down a fucking cool big fire drake and now it's just like, here's a goblin. <laughs> Can we capture it in our fucking pokeball? <laughs> in the pokeball? Can we eat the goblin? No. Okay, what is the logical thing to do with a gerblin? <laughs> like, we got an arrow off of a Fire on Gerblin. Okay, yeah. Nope! <laughs> Incorrect! No. Uh, anyone else in chat got any bright ideas? Oh, speak mm. to Goblin! You know? <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe he's been cold this whole time. Maybe <laughs> speak to Goblin! <laughs> he's just I'm... like, oh no, they're trying to attack us. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna be so upset. Nope. You attempt to reason with the deadly goblin before you. The beast will have none of it and brings to his wickedly pointed cudgel. This is a goddamn Sierra game. Okay. Can I... Just kind of set fire to the carpet instead. Like if I just ignore the goblin and set the rug on fire, mm -mm. <laughs> he's gone, leaving. The... <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, <laughs> what, 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 what the fuck? <laughs> what are you that for? Actually, yeah, what is Quite that? Road. Cool, glowy stuff. But always the, the, the number of doors. The glowy stuff up ahead is not interactable with... Can we look at the goblin? Did we look at the goblin? Yeah, it just says he's really fucking ugly. Which is cool. Me. Uh, 
Like, can we take his weapon? Nope. I guess. Let's take quit. that one. You just, like, cradle him in your arms. <laughs> nope! What was that? What did you do? I tried to take the goblin. No. Oh, just hit it. If it's hit, I'm gonna be very upset because, like, <laughs> I feel like use sword on goblin implies hit goblin, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm very upset. <laughs> Why don't I have an angry expression for this? <laughs> fucking. <laughs> Why is it that. <laughs> just, just get him. Just get him. Just fucking punch the goblin out, I guess. He's got like. You've got two swords and a spear and a hammer and a shield and a sling and some arrows. It's like, no, just punch him. Just kill him. Look at surprise plates across the goblin's face as you throw a haymaker at his Punch fucking throw. shirt off. <laughs> yeah! The sickening crack of the goblin goes down like a sack of potatoes. You shake your hand and mutter in satisfaction. Didn't see that one coming, did you? <laughs> I guess yeah, neither did we, but... anticipating you to use a weapon. I now use sword. Why do you, you just get to grab the shirt? And <laughs> <laughs> this is like the beginning of Terminator. Now can you use sword on Goblin? It's is not it... cannibalism. He's a different species. Unconscious Goblin lies prostrate on the floor. Oh, open no. Goblin. What's wrong with his prostate? Oh, <laughs> you open the Goblin. I don't like that. Open is the way that we search bodies in this video game. It's an interesting crystal, though. Polished surface of the bauble casts a murky reflection. Neat. Okay, so it's water related, I guess. <laughs> Stab that goblin. Stab that goblin. Stab that goblin. Deliver the coup, coup de Gracie. <laughs> so mean. <laughs> but I'm glad it worked. Okay. Neat. Check the goblin's pulse, failing to find any sign of life. Oh, there's been a murder by the nine divines. <laughs> Mumble a hard apology to the dead <laughs> goblins. Sorry, I got you. <laughs> Ouch, you hit the goblin to no avail. Yes, torches, <laughs> finally. Oh, thank oh. god. Now, there's apparently something in this armor. This the armor's obviously too unwieldy. Yeah, I know, but there was something in the visor. Oh, what the hell was that? Part of a mask. Part of a mask. Okay! This is really nice. Like the shitty goblin armor. Oh. Ooh, an old crone skin. What? Soiled and stained tunic is made from the skin of some long dead creature. Slip out of the cloak and shrug the tunic on over your other clothes. Attempt to place the mask piece on your face, but refuse to stay in place. Hit armor. Okay. You strike the goblin armor, accomplishing nothing. <laughs> <It's> a... <laughs> I think not that armor. Is a degracy. <laughs> oh, that armor. That makes sense. You hit the super armor to no avail. Did you open the armor? Have to leave rope and visor. No luck. This one. This one. And this one. Okay. <laughs> Heroic vandalism! <laughs> oh, this is just like Ghost of a Tale. <laughs> oh, a library. Ooh. And some candles. It's like coating of dust. You like the wick of the candle. You like the John Wick of the candle. <laughs> Made from some hide like material, this map shows the continental lands of Cal Torrid. Neat. And we if you like, you're unable to move the map from the wall. Pretty good place to use a torch. Oh, on the books? I see. Oh, you could. Right bookshelf, second... Oh yeah, that one's... Uh, 
kind of a little funny looking. Then on the brewing bookcase, oh, yeah. a little movement of air coming from someplace behind it. And along the edges of the bookcase. That would be a great way to solve a bookcase puzzle. Like, one of these books has a secret lever in it. It's like, okay, I set them all on fire. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you. Crinkle a the book. Right. Sticks of it for opening. My scrapbooks! <laughs> you struggled with poor penmanship you read on. I am honored to have been selected by Fandral to document the workings of the circle. The newest initiative is a young man with an inquisitive nature. He had taken the name of Lachmere and intends to study the origins of time. Though his mastery isn't yet to be chosen, the High One mentioned that Lachmere is not from his line and thus cannot be groomed to become head of the circle. Rather, a new initiate is chosen for an unorthodox scrying, performed by Talomir. You know, the things on the end of DNA. I do not trust that one. He has an ambition and a hunger that does not sit well with the member of the circle. Oh, thank you for that joke made just for me. <laughs> oh man, I'm also, dying, but at least I have this book to read. Fanadrill oh. sounds like a fucking antihistamine. It, it does, it does, it does. Who knows what wisdom is contained within the tome. Lord, and seems to move about almost something that was preventing you from reading the words. Maybe this concussion that I seem to have. The book is locked with <laughs> a metal band binding it closed. Oh, the candles are burnt out. Just, uh... Very nice. Let's see who's now. Nothing is happening after a few minutes you stop trying to... Oh. Oh god. Oh god, so we don't have a lot of time, huh? We have very little time to deal with that. Speaking of time, uh, we have been streaming for four and a half hours, and I think it might be uh, maybe time to wrap up. I think I would like to come back to this at some point and try and finish yeah, it. Yeah, we, because... we should totally try to beat it at some point. I yeah, because now we've got the knowledge to get as far as we got. So, yeah, things we 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 really have to get that banshee out. Kinda early because we can't do any of the gear puzzles otherwise. Um. Yeah, that's true. Because it's got the the marked skull in it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We'll we're gonna find a time to um to knock out the rest of this. I think we might off screen redo that bit so that we're we're there with some more time. Just kind of, you know, ease up our action points or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. But um. Yeah, I think we've we've got a pretty full schedule for um Girl Scream Team Spook Ween Spec Spook. <laughs> we do, we super do. But um I think we could probably fit a bonus stream in here somewhere. Abso absolutely, yeah. So see why not? Um we are gonna uh tune out, we're gonna find someone to raid. Uh I do wanna yeah, yeah, yeah. actually just real quick um give a little shout out to um Someone and I'm stalling for time here because SoundCloud is a bad interface that's hard to navigate. <laughs> uh, um, but um, if you're doing that, be sure to check out our link tree to find us on YouTube. And absolutely, there. we've got dozens of hours of good content for your enjoyment. Yeah, uh, please do follow us on uh, YouTube because uh, you know two other spooky, spooky Wayne streams where yeah. we play the world of horror. Ah, you're doing that without say without opening your mouth. It's really cool. I'm. I'm a great ventriloquist. Mm -hmm. I practice every day. So, uh, courtesy of our uh, friend uh, Midi Meows, uh, whose SoundCloud I've just linked there, and go and uh, check her out. She's great. We actually have an outro theme. Uh, so, uh, I'm just going to play that out now. So, this is uh, Witness Me by Midi Meows. And uh, we're going to uh, mute ourselves and. Uh, let this play out and we'll raid when the track ends so if you want to stick around for a raid uh please do uh let's see. actually before we put that on let me see who's online and who's raidable well, who looks submissive and raidable christ i was thinking it but i didn't say it <laughs> oh, but i did oh shit okay uh scribbly noodle is doing some art streaming so i think we'll Ooh. go over there 
And uh, hey, if you joined us in one of the raids on this channel uh, and you enjoyed what you've seen, please consider giving us a follow here. We'd love to have you come back sometime. Yeah, uh, we're going to be back on Monday with a game that I can't remember what it's called, but it's really cute and scary at the same time. Yeah. Oh my god, what was it? Oh. What is it called? <laughs> no, no, I thought you might have known. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Why do I not it's... just have this up? <laughs> It's got like a U in it. It's got a U in it. I know that. Oh yeah. Uh, so we're gonna be playing some games by a developer called Garment District, and uh, yeah, 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 they will. Uh, they're really cute uh, point-and-click adventure games. They're really fucking spooky. So I'm looking forward to that. Anyway, uh, so we're gonna mute. We're gonna play out this uh, track. So sit around and enjoy "Witness Me" by Midi Meows, and then we'll uh, go ahead and raid Scribbly Noodle. So once again. <laughs> Thanks y'all for coming. Love lovely to have you here. Take care, everybody. And take care and we'll see you again soon. Mwah. Mwah. We'll see you then. <laughs>